understand what just happened. Am I fine now? Am I fine now? My YouTube is always doing something weird. Okay, it looks like I'm fine on Twitch again. What? And what about I'm fine on YouTube now? Okay, sure. <laughs> sure. Whatever. I'm opening my speed stuff. I need to connect my controller. Um, what wires have I been using for my controller? I totally forgot. Oh, I see it. Okay. Well, what a great start. I don't know what happened. I don't know if it was because I was updating a game or what, but sure. Sure. We're fine now. Am I fine now? Oh. Okay. Why is my CPU so high? Uh, excuse me? Speedstorm is... T what? What? Why is my CPU so high? Oh. Are we good? Collection level changes. Wait, whoa, 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 wait, wait, whoa. Okay. Everything looks fine now for me. That was a bit, that was a bit weird. Um, but I think we're good now. I don't, I don't understand what changed. I think it was because I was launching Speedstorm. It kind of borked everything. Well, everything looks fine now. Uh, so we should be good. Okay. But, oh, let me switch out. Do, 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 do. I need to do this, this, and... Okay. <laughs> sure, okay. What do they do? Collection? Collection level changes? Oh, okay, so I level up. That's fine. Is my controller not, is my controller not controlling? Also, am I missing something well, that doesn't look normal? What is that? Why is... What? Is that not a thing anymore? Did I just lose my overlay too? What is going on? Why is it so broken right now? I feel like everything just like broke on my end. Okay, that could happen. And then this is just not a thing. Like even if I switch to it, it's just... <laughs> nope, that's fine. Whatever. Okay, speed storm. I don't need it anyways. Collection level changes. Can I can my controller work, please? Or do they didn't they do something to where it like it alters now? It's my why is my controller not working? All right, thirty nine, now forty. Cool. Ooh. Okay. Uh, controller controls. Is my controller not really not working? Is my controller plugged in? It is. What is? Let's see. I'm like going through like all the issues today, which makes no sense. Uh, unplug it and replug it, and it's just violet. Usually, it kind of like changes to something else. Did I just mess up somewhere else? Am I frozen? Did my camera break? My camera broke. <laughs> uh, duh, what is happening? This is the worst stream of all streams. I'm not keeping this one. <laughs> it's my, okay. Ah, uh, sure, sure. Why is my controller not controlling? Is it, didn't Steam do something with the controllers now? Do I have to like, let's see. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, supports controller. I just saw it. 
it just it just appeared and now it disappeared. Oh, there it is. Controller settings. Controller enable. Is that is that all I needed to do? Okay, let's restart the game maybe. No work. But hey, Panda. <laughs> Welcome into this awful, awful mess of a stream right now. Oh my gosh, it's awful. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it works out fine. Okay, there's my controller. Let's, uh, let's take a look at the shop. Black Friday special. See, I don't spend any of my stuff on that. Okay, cool. Trash, got it. So what it, What else is there? It's, that's normal. Don't have enough. I do have universal box tokens. I have eight, jeez. Whoa, what are these? Limited time? Character packs? Uh, oh. Ooh, these are really cute. Mm, I don't like the Mulan one, personally. I do like the Daisy and Minnie one. And what is all this? This is supposed to be on sale for 90k? No way. I don't like that outfit. I do like this outfit. Cause isn't this like a reference to his little his little sweater that he wears? Um, Figments. I don't care for that one. For you, garbage. Uh no good skins, right? No. Stuff I gotta buy, no. Okay, so my store is looking familiar, at least at this point. Ooh, Lilo. And don't really want anything else. I could get the Nani stuff. I should, because it is a legendary or whatever. Missions, what are the missions? I have been messing up and Wow, I got a lot of weeklies to do. You think the game is muted? Is the game muted? Is it really? Oh my gosh, it is. <laughs> well, thank you, Flip, for saying it. Okay, now you can hear it, at least. I'm already maxed up on the season pass, so I need limited events. Oh, oh my gosh, what are all these? I need to do that. This. I'll try these. I hope I didn't miss anything too grand. I have all the characters right now. There's all this. Okay, that's normal stuff. And why is it saying I need to claim in the starter circuit? What do I have to claim? Unlock feature, golden pass. Congratulations, the golden pass is now open to you. Okay, what's the golden? What's the golden pass? Sure. And then how many am I missing? You still can't hear the game? Oh, what do you mean you still can't hear the game? Okay, what if I... Hmm. Properties... Huh. Why is uh why is everything working? Why is everything messing up? Uh what if I do pro No? What? Uh mute unmute projector properties. What if I switch it to... Why is the audio not working? <laughs> what is with the audio? What's my current audio? My Astros. So what if I switch it to voice? And then I switch this to voice. And I click this. There we go. I see some audio. I see some audio clicking. I think I, I think it's working now. 
Is it working now? <laughs> Can you hear it now? Because it looks like it is good on my end. So I'm assuming everything's all good now. I'm also clicked out of the game for the time being. So I might, um, yeah, I don't know. I see everything's popping up the right way. Well, now the game's quiet. So now you can't even hear it. Um, so we'll do, what is this? It all started with a mouse. Oh, this is easy. Is this supposed to be a challenge? No? Hmm. Manual booze, grind pipe, okay. I hope I get to visit new places. Mickey Mouse, at your service. Mickey Mouse, at your service. All right, I'll do this race and then you tell me if you hear the audio because it seems like for me on my end now, it's actually, I see the little bounces of audio. So it's, sh it, I, I should be able, it should be good now. Gosh, I haven't played Speedstorm in so long. I genuinely forgot the controls. Okay, that's that. Okay. There we go. You hear the audio? Good. Okay. One challenge done. <laughs> Another challenge done. Oh, this is easy. I do need to go on a grind pipe, though. And I probably have to, like, slow up on them. I wish Speedstorm was more new player friendly for people who didn't start all the way in the beginning. Because I feel like if you're if you're a new player playing Speedstorm, it's not fun at all. That's one thing that me and Cory were talking about, is how because we played when the game like basically started um he played a little later than me um that you get like this big like boost of like items and all that and uh it's just like when you're a new player you have to pay for everything oh you don't have a character you have to pay for it oh you don't have this you have to pay for it which is i mean i understand this game needs to make money but dang Everything. And then there's character levels too, which is awful. But this should be easy. I just hope I got my grind pipe done. I also want to diamond up some racers. Um, I won't work on that at all on this stream. I'm just going to do this for a little bit just to get started catching up a little bit. Okay, cool. Oh, uh, so what else? Last wish. Is there no... Oh, this one has tries. Oh, I don't know if I'm really good with Figment. I usually have Cory tried out. Yeah, there's too much stuff in the game for me. It feels a bit overwhelming as a new player. Yeah, there's too much stuff and too much they're trying to like force you to buy. And it's it doesn't help at all. So is this you have to play as Aladdin? Don't worry, yep, my Aladdin's okay. literally nothing. Okay, we'll do something easy since I'm not going to be playing this for long. I'm not going to set myself up for something that I'm not going to finish up. I need... I don't have any days to do this. <laughs> no! What have I been missing? I'll be missing two Abus. See, all that's fine, but I want to get the bread and the two Abus. Well, at least I can do Toy Story, because my Jesse is. Oh, that's interesting. You can see race conditions and... Oh, no. Unlock ranked multiplayer first? What do you mean, unlocked ranked multiplayer? I'm diamond rank with, with, Je with Jesse. I have ranked multiplayer. <laughs> what? I'm diamond rank for Jesse. Sure. Uh... Whatever. That's cool. I didn't- was that always there? That little, like, 
ability bar where it shows the all the stuff that she's got like buffed and all that. Also, Gantu looks really weird just <laughs> in his little car just hunched over. I think this game's great race-wise, but I think that new one that Universal's coming out, All-Star Racers or whatever, I think that one's gonna be better when it comes to a new audience. Because it kind of gives more Mario Kart vibes than a live service vibe. Especially, I don't think they ever announced it going free to play, which also tells you that it's not going to be as live service as this game is trying to be. But I don't like how it looks. The new All-Star Racers does not look good to me. I mean, like, the toothless car is cute or whatever, but I don't know. I don't know if I want to try it. And then the trolls, like, being on all your cars. Maybe I'll do it as, like, a one-time thing if they had a demo. But I don't know if I'm going to invest in, like, the game. But you do have to admit, Speedstorm has really, really, really good music. I love Speedstorm's soundtrack and all the remixes they did. Like, I wonder what the abilities will be for the DreamWorks version. I like how there's Shrek, <laughs> and I like how there's, like, How to Train Your Dragon. Because I feel like How to Train Your Dragon doesn't really have a lot of, like, other media. There was one game I used to play where it was, like, kind of like Mortal Kombat controls. You do combos and whatnot with your dragon, and you fight other dragons. That game was really cool. I might need to find an emulator for that, because I played that on PS... Three, I think. All right, one more time. We'll do, uh, we'll do Buzz. I'm not really good with um, Woody or Bo Peep. I don't think I even leveled up my Woody. <laughs> I don't, I don't like Woody at all. His ability sucks. Kind of with Bo. It's fun. Looks good. Music is good. I don't have the time for another life service game right now, right? I, uh, that's understandable. You can only handle so many live services. I've tried, like, doing, I think at most I've tried doing, like, four live service games. Whoops. And I, uh, I got overwhelmed and ended up stopped playing all, stopped playing all of them. So now I'm only stuck with, I guess, this, Dreamlight Valley, and I think that's really it. There's nothing else I, uh... I've been trying to play daily or whatever. I'm trying to keep like games I would have to log on daily to a very, very small amount. Because Speedstorm already will take you two, three, two and a half hours to get, well, one to two hours really, to get all their stuff done, all the dailies they want you to do. And then those weekly quests are awful. <laughs> They take a lot of time. Especially the ones that ask you to go in ranked. Because ranked is so, like... Just like you have to do some stuff, it's just like by chance. Like, I don't like how some of the quests are like, Oh, you have to stun people in ranked. And I'm like, I don't have to bother people. I don't like bothering people in ranked. I just want to go and just do my race. And if they're there, they're there. I don't- I'm not the type of person who, like, bumps into people or anything like that. Especially with the lag and latency. Cause sometimes I've gotten bumped really bad. And then I try to bump them back and it's like, I didn't even touch them. I did watch a uh, preview for Tears of Pretty after you were talking about it. It looks so good! It's so good, Flip! I'm so excited! <laughs> I'm so ready for that game. I'm sorry, Dreamlight Valley. I am so ready for that game. I cannot wait. It's going to be so much fun. Like, I'm going to be playing Dreamlight Valley as much as I can. 
the first two days or like day and a half I guess and then right when it avatars out I'm buying it <laughs> and playing it I am not wasting my time what level what levels are wow this one's huge holy cow this one's a massive one. Oh, it doesn't tell you the level I was gonna see how much I needed to level up Jasmine during this um, not much I have for you. No. I wish she had a 100 skin. A that platinum look. I wish she had one. Like a platinum with like a lilac purple or something like that. That would have been cute. I can't wait. But yeah, it's so good. The fact that you can fly on your Ekron is so fun. I just wonder if they're gonna ever like mention Jake Sully. Or, um, anything from the first Avatar movie. What? Why did I get hit? But that would be cool if they added, like, a little thing about, like, where we are, uh, compared to the first movie. Because, honestly, I don't know. Because it says, what, you're kidnapped? And then you're in, like, cryostasis or whatever. You wake up 15 years later? Or something like that? So I don't know what time period it's supposed to be in, like, if it's, like, after Sully had kids or before. But it would be cool if we at least got a couple references in the game, or at least mentions of them. It's gonna be so much fun, though. I hope it, uh, it's a long story, too. It's not very short. And by long, I mean, like, maybe two days of gameplay. I don't know how long they've been working on the game though. I should probably look that up. Dude, this is challenge and a half. What level are these? AI? This girl's right on my butt. actually making me nervous. I don't want to lose. Uh, 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 oops. There we go. It's fine. There we go. But yeah, very, very excited. Very hype. Very hype. December is going to be a lot of fun. And it's so close. We're, what? We're a week away now for Dreamlight Valley? Or are we like six days now? What level are these races? 24? Um, I don't really want to use up all my bread. It'll be fine. They made the AI a lot harder in this game. I've been talking to people on that Speedstorm Discord, and for sure they've definitely increased the level of these AI. And they'll make one, like, super buffed. <laughs> they'll make one that's just, like, maybe matching your level, if not one level below you. And they give a challenge. It's this, like, this Meg right now. Everyone else is behind. But this Meg is in front of me. Oh, I gotta sneeze. No, Jumba! No! <laughs> Jumba, too freak you, Jumba! I gotta learn how to take more shortcuts in this race. This race has a lot of shortcuts, it's just hard to see them. For me, at least. Like, I think there's a shortcut here. Yeah. Jeez, not much of a shortcut if I can't get the step ahead. Is there a shortcut here? There is. It's like with all the trees and whatnot. You can barely see it. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> I love the screams that they do. All the girl characters have some sort of scream. The only guy character I think I know that screams is like Mike Wazowski. He just goes, ah! He's funny to race with. I love his character. Him and Genie, dang it, I just lost my shield. Oh, that sucks. Him and Genie are really funny characters. One character that I think needs better voice acting though is Mulan. Her the voice acting she's got going on is a bit weird if you ask me. All right, we'll do one more race and then um, and then I'll switch over. Oh, I didn't do charge skills. Oh, I'll work on that later. Ooh, okay, cool. Oh, red. That's cool how it's also now telling you like what you need in order to star up. Mickey and friends. Oh, this one's easy. We'll do this one. Do I want to level up Mickey? I'll level up. And now he needs to star up. Oh gosh, it's gonna take forever before I star him up. Oh no, not enough resources. What are these? Mickey gloves? And they're not available right now. Cool. That's one thing I hate is like these like little um materials, these gold tier materials are they're not like obtainable at all you have to be around during a certain event or buy it from certain crates and the crates cost money and it's just like geez i can't even like level up out of sheer time i have to actually pay or do whatever you want me to do you stole my boost oh out of the way I wonder if I should have chosen Goofy, because he's a defender. He wouldn't have gotten... No, I should be fine. As long as I stay, I think, at least second. And the person in first has a... Whoops. I should be fine. Jeez, I hate them that boost whenever they get hit. I just need to make sure everyone's down at one and I at least stay in at most or at worst second and I should be really fine. And then we'll switch over to Palea. I finally got that downloaded. I haven't made a character though, so we'll uh we'll make that character together. Dang it. Now I just gotta wait it out and wait for everyone to get eliminated and I'm basically done. Alright, that's it. <laughs> Easy. Those, those races, I think, are really fun. Just, they're so satisfying to play compared to just a normal race. Cool. Alright, um... I don't need your stupid ad. I literally am maxed out on this. Let me open those boxes, and then I'll switch over. Let's see, these. Oh, what did I get? Ooh. This is amazing. Okay, I got camel to tier three. Whatever. Now I got a few of these I can open up. Nothing. How much more do I need for Hercules? 74! <laughs> 74 to get Hercules to another tier. He must be a, like, a four star or something. Cause Mickey is 71 and he's four star. Aw, Flip, thank you for the subscription. <laughs> thank you so much. 
It's much appreciated. You didn't have to do that. Ooh, okay. Shang is three star now. I don't play much with Shang. I don't um I don't like his abilities much either. And then anyone else that's good? Last one. And nothing, Donald. Okay. Let me open Palea. Oh, that's two peas. Is there there we go. I hope I don't have to log in again because my password's really long and I have to make sure it's typed out right right. So if I have to write it again, you're just gonna see my face for a hot second. You're so welcome. I like hanging out. Aw, I like you hanging out too. It's so nice to talk to you. Oh, I have to add my password. Hold on, hold on. My password, I wrote it really long and complicated, and sometimes my keys don't work. So <laughs> I have to make sure that um, it works. Like, for some reason, my B key doesn't work. This is a custom keyboard. And sometimes, like, the switches, I think, just aren't lubed properly or something because um i try to keep this there we go i try to keep this keyboard clean is that it what oh there we go um Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Here we go. Let me switch out the stuff on Twitch too. Because now we're doing Palea. Okay. Choose body type. This is going to be fun. I love customizing. What is this? Is this female? Mm, no, that's a. This body I want to go for. Okay. Oh wow, they have a lot of options. Okay. I try to like to keep the characters looking similar to me. Let me also do one more thing. Um, I need to pop out YouTube's chat as well. So that I don't ignore so many people. <laughs> Hello other guys. Hello YouTube chat. Hello Randy. And another name I can't pronounce because it's all sil uh, symbols. But yeah, I like to try to keep it looking like me. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that, though, with these faces. Um, maybe that one. Mm. I'll do this face. Because I can't lie, I do have a very, very strong, strong chin and small mouth. Skin tone, pale as you can possibly make it. Mm. Looks pretty good. Eyes, my eyes are brown. Hey, they're pretty, they're pretty dark brown. Voice. <laughs> what is that voice? Ooh. Whoa, voice seven. I'll do voice three. I think voice three is, is pretty okay. See, now I don't know how I feel about the face. Um, I'm so indecisive. I usually just end up having Corey do it for me. <laughs> Actually, I kind of just like this face. We'll do that one. Haircut. I have long hair. Super long hair. Hair that I eventually need to cut. It's so long now. Way too long for me. Oh, what is that purple accent? I like black on black. With an extra side of black. I personally think my hair is, though, like a brown. But Cory says it's black, so we'll do, uh, we'll do black. There we go. What kind of hair we got going on? Got this. This is an interesting hair. That, that. Not a lot of long styles. There is a ponytail. I could do a ponytail. Oh, they got a hijab. Cool. Mm. I'll do a pon- Do I want to do a ponytail? 
I like ponytails only for the fact that it kind of like picks up like the quote unquote realism. I'm not really digging the hair down looks though. This one reminds me when I was younger. <laughs> this haircut. I'll do uh, I'll do the ponytail. Yeah, sure. Why not? Hair dye patterns. Oh, there's dye patterns. Ooh, oh, this reminds me when I was like in high school. In high school, I had um, peekaboo highlights, a blonde. Not there wasn't a lot. I literally had like four streaks in my hair. But that was it was a it was my favorite type of hairstyle I had. I don't need glasses. Tops. Oh wow, you could fully like deck out your character from the get-go. I was never expecting this much. Okay. What color schemes we got? Mm. I think we gotta go with a purple. A purple look. Fit in with the theme I got going on. Though red looks nice. We'll do purple though. What is this a dress? Oh, <laughs> the dress is cute. Uh, what are the bottoms so I know what I'm comparing with? Oh, okay. So if I have a dress on, you can't see the bottoms. Makes sense. Mm, kind of like this. I do like the dress. Oh, is this like a robe thing? That one's pretty cool too, to be honest. I think I'll go... Ooh, I don't know. Because, like, you can make a lot of combos. Do you get to, like, keep these outfits, like, in a closet or something later on? Or is it just, like, one and done? I think I might do something like this. This is fun. It's unique. I like it. And then, what is this? Makeup? Oh, okay. Little eyelash stuff. Uh, let's see. Mm, I don't like that. I think that you can barely see it because she's got like her own little eyelash thing going on. These like don't look good. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. These these don't like look the greatest and they have to be black too. It's just like she's got her own little brown lashes going on. So you can't even see. I mean that can work. We'll do We'll do this one. Just so her eyelashes look wispy. Sure, this is the look. Sure. Can I look at the outfit again? Now I don't like the outfit. What's wrong with me? What's this compared to this? Not much. No, 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 am I sure I don't want the dress? Kinda sure. Alright, I'll do this look. Finish. You will not be able to change your body type, face, skin tone, eye color, or voice after your character's created. This functionality will be added in the future update. Oh, okay, that's cool. Sure. I'm good. Enter character's full name. Nestaku. Enter character's nickname. Nesta. Play Pelia as Nestaku? Sure. What? Character creation fail, character registration are in flight. For what you can accomplish. What? <laughs> did I break it? Or did I like accidentally like double click or something? Pro focus, not enough focus, commune with a shrine. I have no idea what's in Palea. I have no idea. Is there, is there even like a story? Okay. Well, that's pretty. Oh, that's really cool looking. Oh, oh, oh. Little stutter. Is this us? We are born. I 
do like the art style. It gives me Kina vibes. Hey. Oh my dragon. Did did you just materialize out of nowhere? More like from a spiraling pink void. Not sure, but I'm glad to be here. While well, I'm here, aren't I? Let's not be mean. Pink void. Oh, tell me more about the void. None of the other humans remember where they came from, so this is kind of a big deal. Uh, that's all I've got. Alright, we'll talk about it later once you're settled in. Uh, we should slow down. Why don't you take this map ahead into town where you can talk to Ashura, the innkeeper. He's been helping others like you settled in. Uh, I would help you myself, but I'm working on something here, and I am days close to figuring it out. Okay. I was so caught off guard, I realized I forgot to introduce myself or explain why I'm here. The name is Gina. I'm an apprentice scholar researching these old ruins. And this here is my research assistant, Hecla. Be sure to ask her if you have any questions. I've got to get back to the grind. Movement, WSD, okay. And looking around, okay. There's me. That's it. I'm not trying to upskirt. I'm just trying to show my face, but there's me. Oh, action bars. Okay, this item. Your action bar outlined by your inventory. Place items so you can use. Okay. Oh, because I'm scrolling through it. Hello. Are you in need of <laughs> she gives Eve vibes with that voice. Hello, human. Um. I know you must have many questions about your spontaneous emergence. Your presence heralds much change in the world of Palea. Uh, what am I? You are a human being, an ancient thing this world has not seen in many rotations. Oh, so we're like in the future. Beyond that, you shall have the answer to the questions of what you are for yourself. Please come again. Okay, sure. Hi, this is my first time here. What is this game about? This is an MMO game. It's like a farming game. I am kind of learning about it too. I just started. <laughs> All right, space, space and W. Cool. Can I run? Okay. Oh, oh, we're loading. All right, so we have energy when we climb. Cool. Is there fighting in this game? Loading. That's pretty. Palea. Very cute. Oh, I'm in someone. Hello, Bria Dora Oki. Hope you are well. I'm off. Find Ashura Kilima. Important objectives like this. Okay, so ESO rules. Map shows. Crossing this can be seen in your party map. Okay. This is uh, interesting. Welcome to Palea. Ah, uh, the, the game's the game's called the game's called Palea. If we just saw the title screen. <laughs> game's called Palea. Very much fun. Very nice. Am I just like having a hard time loading? My thing's probably loading. Maybe I need. Can I change out the how much it's loading? I can't. Oh wait, yes I can. View distance. Let's let's. We don't need it too high to be honest. We'll put it on medium. Put everything else on high. I don't need the best textures right now. You don't need to epic me out. Yeah, that looks fine. Hopefully it runs better now. It's probably because it just has to initially load everything. Okay. Who are you? Shane? Hi Shane. It's been a beautiful day so far. Another child of the Phoenix joins our little village. I must say today is a lovely day to be born. <laughs> I'm Shane, I'm the local ritual sage, a devotee of Maji, the great dragon. It's my job as Kilima's healer and sage uh, to care for our villagers, both physically and spiritually. So how are you feeling? I'm sure this is quite a lot to take in. Uh, this, this, it's a little overwhelming. 
promise everyone in Kilima will do their best to make you feel comfortable and welcome. I do not know why the gods brought you here, but I'm sure it must be some great plan in store. I look forward to seeing it. Now, you'll want to speak with Ashura before you do anything else. Just take this path towards the village. Okay. Thank you. Walk with the dragon. Walk with the dragon. So there's dragons in this game? Or is it just like a behind the scenes thing? That would be cool if there were dragons. This place is nice. So we're in the future. We're ancient. People are ancient. So these people are what? El like elves? Hello. Hi, welcome to the valley. I'm Tish. I run the furniture store. Okay, cool. Are you new to town or just passed through? I, I just got born. Well, that sure sounds tough. <laughs> when my brother and I first moved in, it took us time to adjust. And we were coming from one town over, uh, not another plane of existence. If you need help with any locals, don't hesitate to ask. I'm known as a bit of a grump of a grump whisperer in these parts. What's a grump? What what's what's a grump? Find Ashura. Okay. Uh who are you? Hello, Naio. Naio? Naio? Are we near the end? This must be the end. Is this it? Ashura! Let me look at these photos. That's cool. Very nice. Hello. You have a fine establishment. My blanket is stuck underneath my chair. Eesh. Okay. Visitor sign here. What? Justin Chang, Jimmy Chang, Jasmine, Habizia, Fekri, Beatrice, Shuster Smith. Are these actual players? Justin O'Brien, John McDonald. These must be players, right? Are they just like making up last names or making up names? Another beautiful day. Welcome to Kingdom. I'm sure this is quite a lot to take in. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure the innkeeper at the Ormu's Horn. Fortunately, there isn't any room at the inn right now. But we do have some old plots to the northeast where you could build yourself a tent. What do you say? You want to take in the great outdoors? Uh, yeah, I'm just glad I have a place to sleep. Uh, I would want to some. I would want someone to set me up with a place to sleep and something to eat if I materialize out of this out of nowhere. Why would I not do the same for you? So let's see. To build a tent, you're going to need to collect some materials. Got an axe here for you, but you have to talk to our resident miner Hodari about the pick. Lucky for you, he's checking out the plots right now. You'll want to take the road up the hill to the northeast. Here, I marked it on your map. If you get lost, just come back here and I'll get you sorted out. Okay. Uh, makeshift axe. Nice. Thank you. Whoa. Hello, Lysol. Lysol's looking very clean. Alright, so to get some materials. What, what, which trees do I hit? Which ones are like trees that I'm not supposed to hit? <laughs> oh, is it like, I see a tree. Is this it? Is this it over here? Like this small one? This looks beatable. All right, cool. Loot, loot, loot the, loot the tree, loot. Loot the tree, loot, loot. How do I obtain my, my loot? How do I, ah. I have to take off my axe every time. That feels, oh, I could tap at least. Okay, it's not too bad. Oh, this is so pretty. That's so cozy. Oh. Okay. Uh, let's go up here. Are these the properties. I don't see any. Oh, the music is very nice. I hope I'm going the right way. It doesn't... I don't know if I am going the right way. <laughs> Hello, dear. Hello. Oh. Bye. Oh, why is this tree, like, purple? Can I cut it? Oh. It heals itself. Okay. Hmm. 
Are we over here? Is this my property? Is this like where like it's the my home instance? Since it's an MMO, you gotta have your own home instance. Oh! <laughs> They're so cute! Oh. You're cool. Uh, why not say hello to a friend? Drop in, in on a friend while they're home by interacting with this board. Okay, I have no friends, so that's fine. What? Hmm, scumming along. A lot of trash lifts, though. Oh, hi. Hodori Pavel of Pavel Mining. What can I do for you? Um, you can tell me how you got those biceps. Hi, I'm Nesta. Nesta, huh? Interesting name. I assume Ashura sent you over? I've been sending a lot of new folk my way lately. It's the whole reason I'm checking out the soundness of these campsites. Don't need you all buried in the mud. In fact, this one's about ready for use if you want If you want it. Just needs a bit more work. So you got an axe already? Here, take this pick too. Always good to have the right tool for the right job. He's about to clear the debris, would you? Alright, cool. Mine is hungry work, so you better take this too. My daughter says I need to eat healthier. But you'll get more use to it out of here. More use out of here. Okay. Alright, tools, gathering. What was this? Press and hold R to switch to another tool. Try gathering wood from nearby debris. Okay. Press F. Okay. Simple, simple enough. Let's see. Do we have like an energy bar? Oh, there we go. We can loot with the tool. I wonder why it was not working before. Nice. This game looks so nice too. This game's very, very pretty. Yeah, do we like have an energy bar? Like, why do we ha why do we have food? How do I focus points? What are focus points? Romance pin, romance pin, fishing attachment, fishing bobber, glider, and none equipped. Oh, pets! Oh, <gasps> there's pets in this game. Oh, I like the snowy palicat and the sandy palicat. Those are cute. Okay, so for like a barrel, do I like have to chop up this barrel? Yep. Nice. Okay. Oh, I'm done. I'm done! I didn't realize it. <laughs> uh, I'm done. What? Still lots to do, but it's start. Uh, I found this weird thing. Huh? Found a lot of strange things in the mines, but not sure what this is. Well, you found it, so you keep it. It's your plot after all. I've got other plots to inspect, but there should be a space to drop this work table down now. I suggest you focus on getting a roof over your head and a place to keep your things before you worry about glowing tubes. Is that what we found? Glowing tubes? Do I play on PC? Yes. Uh, bye. Wait. Uh, place your bench... Okay. Let's see. Is it. Oh. How do I rotate? E and Q? Oh. I'll place my workbench just like right at the front. So I don't. That's fine. Craft a tent in the workbench. Okay, what does it need? I need. I can request items. Request up to four different items from fellow Paleans. Your request will be active for a short period of time. Help other Paleans by fulfilling requests. Okay. I don't... I don't need to request stuff. I could just cut down the stuff around here. Let me get my axe out. It looks like I just need to get my axe out.
Yeah, I'll be fine. That's cool that you can, like, request from other people and they can help you out, especially if you're doing this game, like, with a lot of your friends. Or even just with one friend. You both can help each other out. Okay, is that enough? I think that's enough. Hey, it's enough. And a storage chest. I should look into that too. Let's make one of these. Uh, and then place it down. I'll place it down in the center. Whoa, this thing's huge! Okay, I definitely need to clean up a little bit more <laughs> before I even do that. I, I should probably clean up like all this little middle area stuff. Okay, what is this? A mountain morel. Hmm. Okay. And then I get my axe out and cut all this other junk up. Does this game have like a, some sort of like endpoint at all, or does it have like what like what's the end goal? Like what do late game players do? Just farm and decorate? That's what I would assume. Cause that's what like places like uh, Dreamlight Valley is doing. Is that enough space? Oh, that's plenty of space. All right, I want to like center it. So if I just like walk down here, that's pretty good. And I have enough space to walk in it. That's a huge tent. That is that is basically just a low quality house. Jeez. Okay. Um. Talk to Ani when he visits your plot. Oh, but there's okay. Hello. How's it going? Yeah. Whew, good you haven't left yet. My mom, Delilah, told me there was a new human in town, and here you are. I ran all the way from the farm here. She wanted you to have this housewarming gift. Fresh dairy from Daya Family Farm. Welcome to Kilima. And I wanted to, you to have your mail. I'm Ani, I hand, and I handle all the deliveries around here. Twice a day, every day. Rain or shine, six in the morning and six at night. So I think it's safe to say my job is about to get a lot more interesting. Do you like getting mail? You look like someone who would like getting mail. Uh, sure, I love getting mail. <laughs> Good, then I bet you'll be happy with what I have for you. Come on, go check it out. It's your first mail delivery ever. It's some milk. Dear Nesta, I've been informed by Gina that you have been emerged uh, fully formed from the swirling mist. This is wonderful news. Happy day of mist birthing to you. Mist birthing? Other humans call me Enar, and I would like to share with you the joy of fishing. Please take this rod, your possession, and seek me out to, at your nearest convenience. Uh, I shall be located at the pier for the next few millennia. Wow. You're there for a long while. And then Hassian. Uh, to whom it may concern, City Hall requires I send these letters to new residents. You will find a bow and a set of arrows in the attached package. City Hall also requires me to tell you that I am available to tutor you in their use. Uh, during work hours, you can find me in Kinema Village. This is not an invitation to waste my time. I am busy. Aren't you a lovely human? Okay, we got a bow, arrow, and learn how to make arrows. And then, get fishing rod. Okay, cool. Hi, hi, hi. So how are you settling in? This spot's huge. I heard you could find some pretty cool stuff in the dirt. My dad found an old copper arrowhead in our yard last week, but all I've ever seen are some rare rocks. Um, does this weird glowing tube count? Oh wow, it definitely counts. Have you figured out what it does yet? Not yet. Mm, I bet Gina might know. She's always hanging out in the ruins. You should see if she's found something like this before. Yeah. Oh yeah, I almost forgot in all the excitement, I brought a present for you too. A bug scout 
<laughs> official belt and a set of smoke bombs. Smoke bombs? I'm a member of Kilawan's best and only bug catching club. I gotta run now, but if you stop by later, I'll give you some tips on how to use them. But I bet you're hungry right now. You should talk to my dad, Badru, to learn how to grow food and Reth, who works at the inn. He can teach you how to cook it. Okay. You know, everyone's waiting to meet you. Come on, I'll race you out. Gotta head home soon. Um, okay, can I edit my inventory? Well, actually, I don't need to because these have their own spot, which is very nice, actually. Let's do, let's craft a wooden storage chest first. Mm, oh, cool, I have the materials. So, this, this goes right... There. Cool. Um, I want to put this in there. I don't need that. I'll keep my smoke bombs. And I don't think I need milk right now. I'll keep all the other materials. Okay. Leave your housing plot. Gonna head into town. Got a whole bunch of stuff. That's pretty cool though. It's also really cool that you're an MMO and you can, um, you can romance with other people. Welcome to Palea, quest completed. We're so happy to welcome you to Palea. We started Singularity 6 in order to create new worlds that deepen players' lives, and we hope Palea lives up to that for you. As a new startup studio, we're so excited that you found your way to Palea. Can't live without players like you giving it a chance. If you like what we're trying to create and want to support Palea further, the biggest thing you could possibly do is tell friends and family about Palea. It would mean the world to us. We really hope you enjoy what Palea has to offer. Welcome home, Singularity 16. Oh, I'm in someone. I'm in two people. Kai Mochi and... Oh. Okay, so this definitely is, like, the home spot. Okay. Does anyone know how to get the flow stuff? Alright, so they're just talking. That's so weird that it's an MMO. <laughs> That's a... Uh, I haven't played an MMO in a very long time. Let alone, like... Uh, let alone pay attention to, like, chats and all that. The last MMO I've ever touched was ESO. And that game was really fun, but I never... I never really uh, paid attention to chat that much. Let's see... We'll go this way first. Is this where Gina is? No, this is where Badru is. Uh, can I help you out? <laughs> You're adorable. Well, if it isn't another friend I haven't met yet. I'm Badru, the farmer, and I sense we have some good times ahead. Uh -huh. Did I mention in addition to farming, I also do stand-up comedy? <laughs> Filling out a request and giving gifts improves your relationship. Oh, okay. Uh, can you teach me to garden? Uh -huh. Come to the right place if you care it about fresh quality produce. <laughs> Honestly, I'm impressed to see you going after what you want. If I had that kind of gumption, maybe I'd be doing more of my life than just making ends meet. Aww. I'm just kidding around. Farm's life is great, especially if you love the smell of ormu manure. Ormu? What's an ormu? Uh, in the morning. I'll admit it's a bit of an acquired taste. Tell you what, meet me on your plot later and I'll walk you through the steps. Okay. It's hard to be mad at life when the sky looks like this, don't you think? Look at that cloud. What do you think that cloud looks like? Um, I don't see it. It looks like a head of lettuce. A head of lettuce. I see it. I was gonna say a big circle, but I guess you're more of the creative type. Or maybe you're just hungry. Cute. And orange. Cause I'll see you around. <laughs> That's really cute. Let me talk to Reth or Gina. I need to talk to someone in here and then I'll go back to my place. Reth! Oh, hey. Oh, hey. You're one of the newbies, right? Whoa. Name's Reth, but you can call me Trouble. <laughs> in addition to being bad news, I also provide Kilima with delicious soups and stews here at Ormu's Horn. Ooh, I had a nice soup um, last night. That was so good. Stop by later, yeah? Always happy to chat with a new friendly face. Uh, can you teach me to cook? Oh, there. You gotta learn to walk before you can swim. Unless you're a fish, but I'm like 97% sure you're a human. 
why don't you start by making campfire for your place? Uh, once you start grilling up shrooms like a champ, we'll get started on the complicated stuff. Oh, if you don't want to be stuck in a tent for the rest of your life, probably a good idea to talk to Ken Lee next. He's the mayor, but hey, I won't judge you either way. Okay. Really looking forward to the end of shift. I have a recipe I want to try out, but I left the ingredients at home. Right. Ooh, okay. wonder if I can get that for him later. Alright, we gotta craft a campfire, so I'm assuming we have to go home for that. And who's over here? There's a lot of people to talk to. I'm also glad that this is like a farming game that also has quests. Now we can look around. She's pretty. Kenyatta. Hmm, okay. Okay, Kenyatta, I see. You the mayor? Yep, you are. You look like a mayor. Excuse me, excuse me. Greetings, fair traveler. <laughs> Greetings, I'm the Honorable Kenley Bahari, the firstborn son of late Kenjun Bahari, the 118th Duke of Bahari Province, and brother of Kenyara Bahari, the current Duchess of the Bahari Province. I am mayor of this fine village, and it is a great pleasure to honor and welcome you here among us. Okay, I wanted to ask about getting a house. A house? And you're, uh, you're asking me? Well, personally, I inherited mine. Have you tried that? I want to build my own. Oh, right. Oh, yes, of course. Because you just moved in. The uh, plot didn't come with one? No matter. I'm sure I have the paperwork around here somewhere. Just give me a moment. Oh, no. Where is it? Hmm. I'll tell you what. Go find Tish, our resident carpenter. I'm sure she'd be delighted to get you started on the nice furniture I uh, locate these for us. Okay. Okay, okay. So we have to go... Talk to more people. Let's see. Let's talk to her then. I think she's closer. Oh, you have a question mark. Uh, hello? Cassian. Oh, you're the one that gave me the bow. So, unconditional affection. Aww. <laughs> He's so cute. Tao looks at you with a dance patient. You want to play? Tao wags his tail excitedly. Aww. That's adorable. Let me talk with you. I need to talk to you. Oh, aren't you all nice, Nesta, I presume? Don't ask Donna that I know your name. I know everything that goes on in this village, including when someone new arrives. My name is Hessian. I'm in charge of maintaining the natural order of the woods that surround the village. Be good to the valley, and we will have no quarrel. Uh, use nature poorly, and you'll find, you'll find I know how to rid this village of all sorts of pests. Wow. I got your letter. My what? Oh, those pre-written letters City Hall had me sign? My mother is the town blacksmith. A simple bow like that is an easy is an easy supply. It takes years to learn proper hunting. Start by aiming that bow at something. Like those chapas or surnook. Maybe you'll even manage to hit your target. Okay. Hey. What do I like to do for fun? I like to be left alone with my thoughts. Find myself to be all the company I need. Perhaps you should learn to become more comfortable with solitude yourself. You're so nice. You're- it's- it- I'm so glad I met you. You're great. Very, very good. Is she in here? No. What's in here? Oh, you're so cute! What is this, like food? Like candy? Oh, a backpack. Ooh, we need one of those. Are you like a general store? Oh, you're Delilah. Okay. Let's see. What else can I work on? She in here? Oh, this looks like furniture that you can buy. There she is. Tish! Good to see you. Can I interest you in any new furniture? Uh, Kenley sent me. Ah. So glad you're going to live here. I was trying to come up with a good welcome gift. When I realized the house isn't much of a home without furniture. So here's some simple recipes for you to start with. If you're tired if you're tired from all your work hard work, why not build yourself a place to sit or a table to eat at? My friend Jell insisted you have a wardrobe too. He's a tailor and always says looking your best makes you feel your best. <laughs> Even if there's something you can't make now, I'm sure inspiration will strike you as soon as you start building. Oh, okay, thank you. The front of the store highlights our rotating collection. I always love getting new pieces from vendors all over Palea. 
Alright, cool. Do they really? Let's take a look at your furniture. That's a cool piece. Moonstruck bookshelf. 6k. Ravenwood floor cabinet. Oh, I like these. Little clutter items. Fruit baskets and all that. That's really cute. We got lamps. Lighting. This is really nice furniture. Oh, I like this one too. Moonstruck lantern. Um, one last person to talk to and then we can go back to our place. Oh, I love how he walks. <laughs> He's adorable. Uh, whoa. Buddha. That's cool. They look really cool. Spending a lot of time on this game, I presume. Uh, I'm gonna try. This game looks really, really pretty, but I'm seriously gonna try to... <laughs> to not succumb to cosmetics. Hey, Nesta. It's good to see you again. Did you get settled in alright? Um... Actually, I found something you might be interested in. Really? What is it? Oh, wow, I can't believe it. This thing is an ancient flow battery. What's a flow battery? These are the power sources for the ancient humans. I've been looking all over for something like this. And you say you just found it under some old junk? Uh, yeah, it must be fate. I'm not really a believer in fate, per se, but this is some coincidence. It might take me a bit of time to figure out what this does. I'll send you a letter once I know something. Okay, cool. So that's all done. Now I think we can go home, right? Not totally sure what the ruins around the village used to be, but based on the fact that the buildings cluster around a central square, the plethora of old books I found in the subterranean structures, and the fact that there's no that there's space in, in the meadow where there are no ruins that kind of looks like a sports field, I would guess some kind of school. Although it's possible human civilization wasn't organized in the same way ours is, so I may be totally off base. Okay. Look at all these people. That's so weird that you could just see these people. Alright, let's head home. Home is... don't actually know where home is. Northeast, right? So around this way? Where is home? Maybe I should check my map. What is this? Create a community. Oh! Cooking 101. Map. I want to go home. Home. Home, home. Where's... There's still some people that I need to talk to. Okay, I guess because they just weren't close by. Maybe that's home. I think that's home. Inventory. Ooh, I T posed there. I saw that. Relationships. A whole bunch of people. Oh, that was so cute. Accomplishments. Okay. Do these give you rewards? Oh yeah, they do. They give you some sort of like furniture or whatever. Okay, sure. Relationship community. Cool. Um, let's go home. And clean up a little bit over there. Because I know we got lots to craft now. Actually, lots to craft. <laughs> and we have a little bit of materials there. Like, can you actually walk up and steal someone's resources? No. Angel Frosty McNuggy. <laughs> Prophecy Girl. That's a pretty name. I'm over here with like a lame old Twitch username. That's Taku. Thanks for waiting, you'll be home soon. Three paleons ahead of you? Is there really like a loading queue, uh, queue to each uh, area? Huh. That's weird. I didn't even think about that. I thought since it was like your own instance that you didn't have to worry about it. Okay. Badru! Good to see you again, Spring Bean. This place is already starting to look different. I figure you still be working on setting up that tent. That's some work ethic. Um, I like making this place feel homey. Just the right answer. I'm sure you're gonna fit in here just fine. I bet you've been working up, uh, up an appetite from all that chopping and mining. Well, if you got patience, I've got a solution for it to your woes. Gardening. All you have to do is wait a few sun cycles and voila, dinner or breakfast, even lunch. If the mood strikes you. I know, I know, it doesn't sound exciting, but trust me, nothing tastes better than a carrot you've grown yourself. 
I've got all the tools you need right here too. Go on, why don't you drop this pot down and give it a good till. Happy trails. Okay. So, you don't get a hoe, you just get plots. Make sure you garden plots. Gardening. Wait. Okay, so you gotta... Oh. Alright, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Not really... I don't want... <laughs> I don't care to read it right now. We'll, uh, we'll clear this place out. And put it, it just here in the front. Oh, the water looks really pretty in this game, too. Very, very nice. I, I'm, like, so worried I'm gonna fall in love with this game and then be 100% obsessed with it. I'm so late to a party, now I regret missing out. Okay. So, place this down. We're gonna place it in this little corner here. here. Yeah. Place it there. I'll we'll place another one right below it. Nice. Okay. I don't have a- oh, I do have a hoe. Am I doing it? Oh. Oh, that's really cool. Huh. I was never expecting something like this. This is actually a really cool mechanic. Alright, so that's one plot done. That's another plot done. I don't know how much he wants me to actually dig out. Maybe I should stop right there. Well, howdy, Sproutling. You might be wondering what you do next, unfortunately. Uh, seeds don't plant and water themselves. Ah. You're gonna need some of these bad boys. Consider them a housewarming gift. Once your seeds are in the ground, go to that pond and fill uh, this up uh, fill up this here water can and give that dirt a nice little bath. It might take a few si sun cycles and a few buckets of water, but trust me, it'll be worth the wait. Some things you plant might have an effect on the seeds around it. For example, carrots and onions keep weeds from growing next to them. If you find yourself needing more seeds, you can pick them up at Zeki's. Well, I can't wait <laughs> to see you again, neighbor. That would have been funnier if I'd given you wheat seeds. Hmm. I gotta work on my material. Oh, he's adorable! Okay, so I got four... Okay, I got four and four. So I'll just do... This, and then the one below it. Or the one to the side of it. There we go. And then I'll do the other four here. Nice. Trying to make sure it's all nice and clean. Oh, I found something. I found a vase. What is a vase doing in my dirt? There we go. Renown. First selling discovery. Uh, what was it though? I'm not gonna... Okay. It's fine. I don't need to see it. Put there. 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 And then we'll put this. Boink. So then there's no weeds that should grow on this, right? And then I need a watering can. Daisy insects. Press and hold to start. Oh. When the insect is hit by a smoke bomb, it will attempt to break away. If they fail, they'll become dazed and can be picked up off the ground? So instead of a bug net, I have to throw bombs at bugs? Increase your skill to unlock new types of smoke bombs and more powerful belts that can increase your chance at dazing insects. Okay, I was totally uh, sure. Uh, your crop will never wither, only progress. Okay, that's good to know that they won't wither. And since I'm assuming, like since it's an MMO, I'm assuming seasons don't really take place. The water can's empty. I know, I'm trying to fill it. There we go. Yeah! Nice! What was that? What was that noise? And last one? Done! It did it! And he's not here anymore. 
Okay, so let's work on the other stuff we have to do. Place a chair, table, wardrobe, and campfire. I can make a campfire. I can place the campfire right in front. Yeah. Oh, that's so cozy. Yeah. Oh, that's so cozy. Forage for mushrooms. There's mushrooms like all around my house. Uh, table, chair, wardrobe. All right, definitely need to cut more trees for that. And I have a bunch of trees here. There's kind of some trees I want to keep. Maybe I'll start... I don't want to ruin all the trees that are right near me. Like, in my property. I kind of like them there. I'll take out these smaller trees. Can I take out this big tree? No. Need to upgrade my tool. Okay. How do they grow back? That's another thing. Like, will these around me grow back or not at all? I would assume they grow back at some point. Let's get that mushroom. I'll do the ones farther back. Just in case they don't grow back fully. Oh, what's that back there? What is this? Is this like for future story? Oh, there is stuff back there. So at some point it's probably going to be unlocked. Okay, cool. Nice. Um, let's do a little bit more. I'll do two more trees and see how much, how much of that's got me. Wah, ba, ba. Okay, that's more than enough for me. Hopefully, I have fifty-three. I'm assuming like this max stack is like ninety-nine. And but uh here. Oh, we can craft a lot. Fences, torches. Okay, so we need one of these. And then table wardrobe. Oh. What should I learn to make? Uh this is cute looking. Log cabin armchair. That's so cute. What is this? Emerald carpet moss. Filling your home with bright color of emerald carpet moss said to bring good luck. Ooh, I gotta figure out how to get that. Let's get this table. Uh, let's make a- let's just want to make a bed. Oh, cabin bed. And then wardrobe. Wardrobe. Here it is. Oh, I need more wood. Okay. I'll go back here and get some more wood. Is there different wood types too? I wonder. It is a decent amount of wood, which I'm really happy about. Maybe like the wood color is like based on like wood level. No, because that's, no, that doesn't work. Small trees it is for my character. Nice. And we'll get that mushroom. Okay, so we gotta cook the mushrooms, place all the furniture, and we should be golden. Let's see. Um, oh, I need five more! <laughs> Dang it! Okay. There we go. That should be more than enough. Ooh. <gasps> A little deer. Yes, please. Log cabin garden cernuk. Oh, it's adorable. I'll definitely have to make that at some point. All right. Now we got a table, which can go here. A little chair. Which can be like that. And then our wardrobe, which can go kind of 
of here, like tucked away a little. What's in the way? How wide is this thing? Oh. Here we go. Oh, so I can change my clothes to whatever. Oh. Okay. Not too. Okay. Oh. Oh. What are all these? All oh, the flower crowns are cute. Oh, <laughs> the lily pad leaper. That's adorable too. Oh man, am I gonna be a sucker for cosmetics? I hope not. I'm assuming like some of this is like, is this some of the store stuff or is this all stuff that you can earn? Mm, I don't know. Silf set? Well, let's take a look at the store. Not gonna buy anything, but I do want to browse. Purchase pet pet purchase bonus. Unlock one pallet cat with your first paleo coin purchase. Unlock three additional types of pallet cats when you purchase your first three thousand plus paleo coins. Sure. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. Uh. I mean, this is cute, but. I don't know. I'm not I'm not really into how much do the cosmetics even cost? I'm sorry. What? So for thirty four hundred, that's thirty two dollars. <laughs> for thirty four hundred, that's thirty two dollars. So for our entire set, it's thirty two dollars. Twenty five fifty each. Wow. That's. Wow. I've seen a lot of people wear the fairy outfits. And they are cute. I definitely like... I think I like this one. And this one. Wow, bro. <laughs> bro with the prices. Holy cow, dude. Oh, they got like Lolita stuff too. Alright. Uh, yeah. I'm not... I'm not too... Entranced by these things. <laughs> this looks really this just looks funny oh <laughs> uh, sure is this all uh there's some um... okay cool that's insane that's insane so it'll be like 50 plus dollars for the all the other ones for all the um all the fairies wow okay Cool. That's, uh, that's interesting to know. I think this is cute. I would might. I might. If anything, I would probably just get that. I don't need it. We got a lot of nice clothing options. So. That's totally fine if I don't get anything. Um. So is this, like... So they're mixing stuff like this with, like, paid cosmetic stuff, basically. Let me see. Yeah, they are. That's fine. That's whatever. I just hope there's at least some stuff you can earn. Just a little bit at least. But if not, then, you know, they give us really good clothing options anyways. Like, you even get, like, a dress that you can dress up in and it looks really cute. Um, but okay, sure. Like, this is cute too. You know what? I'll change up. I'll do, uh, I'll do with this with, give me a different bottoms. Let's see. Am I going to do a matching set? We'll do a matching set. Sure. New outfit, new vibe. Oh, hey, Kenley. Oh, I can just walk right through you. Have you seen my hat? <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful news! I found the forms under the bookshelf in the records room. They're only a little crumpled too. If you could just sign here and here, I'll be able to get you that blueprint. Okay. Yes, and here too. Oh, and here. There we have it. And I even remembered to bring the blueprints with me. These are now yours, Nesta. I suggest you plop the frame down as soon as possible and get building. Now, if you excuse me, I do believe it's time for my break. Okay. Could you yeah, see ya. Alright, uh, let's cook those mushrooms too while we're at it. Cook 
use star quality ingredients? Just cook them. Do I have to stand here and cook them? No. Okay, cool. And then what? Did the water of these go down? Weed prevention, weed prevention. No? Okay. Done. Eat grilled mo mushrooms to gain focus. How do I consume? How do I, how do I eat? Do I, there we go. I have to left click or right click it. Okay. And then use 50 focus. Focus increase experience gain from all sources and it is regenerated by eating. So focus is like an XP buff. And then let's look at the foundation. How much is that gonna set us back? Mm. Place foundation for your house. How? Is it something I have to craft? I'm assuming it's something I have to craft. I don't see it here. Mm. What is this? Fur. I don't see it. Am I supposed to see it? How do I place the foundation for my house? Is it my mailbox? No. What is this? Coin purse running flat. Place items in the sales bin and they'll be sold soon. Items are picked up for sale each morning and evening. You'll get paid when you return home. Out of town, shops will buy the same sort of items as they sell as long as it's business hours. hours. Zeki's General Store has deals in the wildest variety of things. Uh, okay. Sure. How do I... Where's my foundation? I don't see my foundation. Let me look at these. Are there anything that's like actual earnable? Chapa Hunter, Sanuk Hunter. So like you earn, you can earn furniture and trophies and wallpapers. That's nice at least. What is this? Founder Award. Congratulations, Nessa. You are one of the very first players to join the world of Paleo. Please enjoy this welcome gift from us. We hope it makes your journey even more joyful. With heartfelt thanks, the Singularity Six team. Okay, cool. Claim. We got a Founder's Windmill. Fun. How do I place the foundation for my house, though? R? No. How big is this windmill? Oh, it's tiny! <laughs> oh, that's so cute! It'll go right there. That's so small and adorable! Okay. Cool. Uh, foundation. Foundation for my home. H? Oh, whoa, you can own all this property? No way. Harvest house. This place is huge too! Okay, so I have to tear down this. You must pick up all the interior decor first. Okay. No, oh, no, 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 Back. Oh. You know what? The bun can work. I'm in a bun now. How do I control? Oh. Oh, I'm learning. There we go. And now H, let's place this house down. Okay. So you can do like Sims type building. Cool. Um, e. All right, so I definitely need to eliminate basically all these trees right here because they are in the way I'm back and I have hot chocolate how's the game so far <laughs> how's the hot chocolate um it's good I'm learning the uh to me I think the prices of the freaking store in this game is out the wazoo if you ask me 40 bucks 40 50 bucks for three skins is I mean that that's a that's a lot if you compare to Dream Life Alley. I mean I don't know. I mean I guess they're three skins. Maybe like if I mean I can't imagine what Dream Life Alley would charge for to be honest. For three whole skins. 
But we actually got a house going. We just gotta clear out this area and then we can place it down. And I would no longer have to live in a tent. Tree chopper, okay. What, do I collect anything or is it just telling me that I did that? I think it's just telling me. I haven't collected anything, okay. Nice. Okity a dokity. Now we can place down this. I have enough space for sure. Uh, I want to make sure it's like centered. Or as centered as I can make it to the entrance. The entrance is actually right there. Uh... Oh no! This is a free to play game, isn't it? Yeah, that's true. Are they gonna remain free to play? Like when they get out of their alf their uh, early access? It would make sense if they do, I guess. Okay. Not a gatherable actor. Add resources to your building and complete construction. Okay, how much resources is it needing? A hundred? What are stone bricks? Oh, I know nothing about stone bricks. Oh, hey, Tish. What are stone bricks? Oh, good. You're still here. Kenley mentioned he found the blueprint for your house, so I thought I'd stop by to give you some other helpful tips. If you want to finish your house, you'll need stone bricks, yep, and sapwood planks. So get comfortable with wood cutting and mining. You met our innkeeper, Ashura, right? He can teach you to make a sawmill for those planks. And Hodari sells the stone smelter you'll need for bricks. If he's not in the village, check Bahari Bay to the east. That's where he lives. So happy to hear you've decided to make Kilima your home. I'll have to stop by soon again with some housewarming gifts. Oh, yes, please. Okay. Um, so. I have to leave, right? Basically, I have to go out and about. Go talk to in guy. What game is this? This is Palea. It's a MMO farming gathering game. I'm still getting used to the queue being a thing. But this is fun so far. I like the, I like how everything looks. Look at that fairy outfit. That fairy outfit is very pretty though. I don't know if it's $34 pretty in my eyes, but whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we can just randomly climb things, sure. <laughs> Did not know that until now. All right, he is in town. Can I dive and fall damage? I'm fine. I'll take that as a no. So, where is he? Also, the game runs really well now, so I'm assuming it was just like they had to load all the assets in at the beginning, and now everything's like loaded, it's good. Uh, hello? Ashura! Hello there, friend. I know starting out in a new place can be tough, but you've been doing a great job. Yep, yeah, my eyes itchy. Thought I'd help you out. I got a couple of recipes for purchase that might make your life a little easier. You'll probably want to get a sawmill first um, thing first thing to turn some of that wood into planks. Oh. I'm broke. Ashura? I'm poor. Make the most of each day. Ashura? You're charging me? Okay, I gotta make some money. Whoa. Oh, here's a something for me. What do you have for me, Onni? Didn't expect you. <laughs> You're here? Awesome. You got your belt and your smoke bombs, right? Before we get started, you gotta make the Bug Scout's oath. Just repeat after me. I promise to honor nature and all its creatures to always lend others a helping hand, and most importantly, tell Ani if you need see anything really cool. Uh, I promise. Awesome. Welcome to the Bug Scouts. Hmm. Why don't you try catching something easy to start? Remember, though, certain bugs will only come out at certain times. Huh, okay. My family runs the farm down the road. We grow the biggest vegetables. My mom won blue ribbons at the fair like a million years in a row. Gotta head home soon. What is 
like the ages of everyone here. How old? How ancient is everyone? Hello, Stifu. Holy Kazoli, Stifu is buff. Um, so we gotta catch a bug. We gotta sell stuff. Maybe hunt, too? Fish? Does fishing give good money? We do have a fishing quest. So maybe that will be our best bet. Use social panel. I don't want the social panel. This was a mistake. Okay. I didn't mean to do that. I was just trying to figure out my quests. Yeah, we have a hunting. Can I pin it? Is it? Do I have too many pinned? Oh, I have too many pinned. Okay, so I need to make money anyways. So let's take out the cooking and put in... I already put in the hunting. Didn't I have a fishing one? We'll do bug catching then. Okay. Um, I have to go here. It's telling me to go here. Doing the doing the falling. Catch a common blue butterfly. Catch a Kiliwa night moth. Kiliwa night moth. So why is it directing me here? Was that, am I supposed to go here, or is it just saying this is here? Oh, it's a fast travel. Uh, can I fast travel then? Go home. It costs money! Too poor! <laughs> I'm too broke! I have nothing! I need to go out into, like, the wild. Can I sell my house? Actually, my tent? My tent can make a pretty penny. Cannot be sold. Okay. <laughs> Okay, can't be sold. Do I have a fishing rod? I do. Hold down and aim your cast. Release cast. Wait for a big bite before you see a large splash. Um, the fish will nibble three times. On the fourth, press and hold. Start reeling in. Control your brackets by moving mouse left and right. Only reel when the fish is inside the brackets. When the fish is outside the brackets. Okay. Is there like anything to fish here? Is there- is this not- these waters ain't- are not fishable. Oh, but that is over there! Ooh, This is fishable. Okay, let's see- let's see how- let's see- oh! Let's see how well we do. Is it- am I too far out? Uh... Oh my gosh! Okay, maybe I need to take a step back. I am like, it goes so fast. No, can I like back it up? I'm backing it up. <laughs> I'll stand over here. There we go. Nice cast. One, two, That was it, right? Or was that not it? That was probably not it. How do I- How do I redirect? What? <laughs> that was awful. I did a horrible job. Okay, let's try one more time. Do I redirect with the mouse wheel? Was that- Was it suggesting the mouse wheel? One. Two. Three. Okay. Stay with it. Stay with it. Come on. No, stay with it. Stay with it. You. T <laughs> okay, I need to stop reeling. First off, I'm reeling. I'm noticing I'm reeling. Um. Let's go up here. Roundabout over here. All right. Let's try this hole. Literally, it's our last chance. I got this. I got this. This is easy. One. Two. Three. Okay. Stop reeling. Move. Move the fish. Oh my gosh, like the sensitivity needs to be like, nope, 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 nope. Move the fish. Come on, fishy, move. No. <laughs> What? 
can I... Where's the tutorial? I need help. I obviously don't know how to fish. Player support. I need support. Oh, I just opened something that I did not need to open. Okay, fine. Whatever. All I know is that I'm really bad. <laughs> what? Uh... Sure. Is there any fishing holes here? I feel like I had it, but like the fish barely moves. Like I'm like moving my mouse and the fish is not moving. Is my sensitivity too high or too low? Okay, we're moving, we're moving, there we go. No. No! Why are you swimming that way? Stop swimming that way! <laughs> Am I moving the wrong thing? Am I supposed to be moving the green thing? Maybe I'm moving the green thing. I'm thinking I'm moving the fish. Maybe I am actually moving the green thing. Fishing should not be this hard. I should not be this dumb. Nope, that's not it. Uh, back it up. That's- that's pretty okay. At least no one's around to see my failures. Okay, I'm moving the green thing. Holy cow, I'm so dumb. There we go. I thought I was moving the fish for some reason. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Aquariums and terrariums. Oh, that's cool. You can have an aquarium and a terrarium. And those look really nicely detailed, too. You've caught a star quality item. Star quality bugs and fish can be placed in their own terrariums and aquariums. Cool. How much is it worth? 31. It's okay. I still need to learn how to catch a bug and hunt. Hmm. Oh, there's something there. Do I hunt these? Equip the bow and hold to draw to remember the arc of the arrow and find the targets. Creatures will flee if you miss or are unable to fell them in a single hit. Chasing creatures is an integral part of hunting. Higher hunting levels will be able to press press square. Cool. To open the ammo bag. Click your preferred ammo. Okay. Ah, oh, see, like he's scaring them. But I want to hunt that thing right there. Oh, okay. Maybe this one. How do I? <laughs> he just exploded into a bag. Okay. And you. I need to chase you. Okay. I can't get too close to you, so basically I'm just like chasing you until you stop. But you're damaged. Oh, there's a blue butterfly right here. Oh, it's fine. I could just turn around. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Oh, come on, you little turd. Stop running. Get over here. Oh my gosh, it's running so far. Is it because I'm running? There we go. Okay. That worked. Looks like your inventory is full. Extra items are stored in an over in overflow for item for a limited time to help you manage your inventory. Eventually, items in overflow are destroyed or replaced by new ones. Treat full inventory seriously. Okay, dang it. That means I can't catch my... I should have put my furniture away. Where's home? I need to go home. Home is here. I need to remember that. All right, let's run home. Okay, hunting's not too bad. Deer was a bit finicky. And fishing is a lot easier than I was making it out to be. <laughs> fishing is not as bad as it actually is. Lady luck. Hello, lady luck. Goodbye, lady luck. Is this person, oh my gosh. Ani looks like a cauldron with legs from behind. <laughs> he just looks like a walking pot. 
And traveling's not too bad. And I saw that there was fast traveling. I just need to make money for it. I do want to keep this fish, though. I'm like a so... I'm, I'm an animal lover. And if it's a star quality, which I'm assuming not all of them are star quality, I'm keeping this one. Hello, Spac and whatever that other person's name was. Dave? I saw Dave curling. Dove, maybe? This game's fun. It's not too uh, overwhelming with people, which I'm really glad about. I really thought it was going to be like overwhelming with all the people around. What is this? Sir Nook Hide. Hmm. Okay. I don't want to sell my fishy. I want to actually place him down. Hee <laughs> hee! Look! Guys, it's our first fish! Oh gosh, his eyes. <laughs> He looks so creepy. He looks dead. He looks like a statue more than anything. You scared me. What is that? Is that the good sweater? Yeah, I wore it today. I was looking for it. I was freezing this morning, and then there. I found this one because this one's pretty thick. Oh yeah, can you uh, can no you feed? Can you feed him? Yeah. How was work? It was good. Oh, good. Okay. Um, let's. Is there anything else I should put away? I think I'm fine on space now. I don't really need... I'll sell the meat. I don't really need the meat right now. Uh, blink and blink. That's 26 buckaroonies. We are a quarter of the way there. I'll, uh, let me... I'll, I'll catch these bugs if I can. And I think I'm gonna just hunt and fish. Fish? The fish one was pretty good. Oh, I totally forgot what fish type we got. It'll be fine. I'm like uh, in like Stardew Valley brain where like you have to like keep one of everything. It's just I don't have a lot going on right now. I'm very, very new and very, very poor. Just like real life. Um, there's something I can hunt over here. Oh, I can talk to you. What is that? Oh. Whoa! Okay, sure. <laughs> I was more enamored by the grasshopper. Hey, Hassian. Why have you returned? Did you think I would praise you for a job well done? It is every paleon's duty to help maintain the balance of nature. In the interest of per perpetuating that balance, I'm obligated to give you this. Mm. Chapas are not natural to this environment. They, are, they overpopulate and destroy wildlife uh, and vegetation. It is only right that you humans help before you two begin to run wild. You may leave me alone now. I'm sure any further contact can be conducted over mail. Try not to cause any trouble. I won't, I won't. Okay, um, is that grasshopper still around? Because I have smoke bombs, no? I don't see, it's not around anymore. Okay, that's fine. Oh, there's something over here. So what's over here? Okay, so I have to... That did not do it at all. Did it? <laughs> did that work? There we go! A common field cricket. Okay. And that one's not a startup, so I could sell that one. I'll hunt this. Oh, I thought I hit the grasshopper. Also, what are these? Sun drop lilies. Okay. Hunting is fun. Oh, I missed. Can I collect my arrow? Oh no. I say hunting's fun when I miss horribly. Oh, it's gone. Oh, there's a deer over here, though. Oh, there's plenty of deer over here. What? What happens if I get a headshot ever? So two hits and the deer's good. So new. Ooh, I got antlers this time. Oh, let's see the butterfly. Ah, oh, come on. Which one is it? I think mine's the one that's like really far away. 
ice. Can I go get that butterfly? I saw it back here. Um, it's gone. No, it's not. It's not gone. It's not gone. Eeh. Oh, that was a horrible miss. Do I have to shoot below it or at it? Oh, I'm... What, what do I hit? Do I hit it? I'm hitting you. There we go. Yeah. Loot. Loot it. Loot. Why can't I loot it? There we go. <laughs> what was that? There's another one, too. Alright, so I definitely have to hit directly at it. Uh, nice. Look at me, I'm a professional. Though this looting thing is a bit weird. I'll get this last one, too. I need all the monies I can get right now. All of it. Any stars? No stars. The crickets one is like... There's a chance for them to get away. It seems like for the butterflies, it's like definite that they can't get away. I'll get these deers too. Oh, you're moonwalking. <laughs> oh, and you went through a tree. Oh, which one is you then? Oh, I'm just shooting at random ones now. Oh, but this one's a different colored one. I wonder if that matters. Okay. I want to get that different colored one. Ooh, but I gotta go. Alright, I'll keep the starred meat, like I said. Shouldn't be too far from home. Oh, wait. Return home. I didn't know that! <laughs> you can hit the return home button? It was behind my freaking um, screen, so you guys couldn't see it. Okay, cool. Still gotta wait the queue. The loading screens are pretty, too. <gasps> home sweet home. Do I join, like, a new server every time, like, I load somewhere? Alright, let's sell. How do I, like, confirm sell? Oh, 14 minutes. Okay, so we're gonna sell two of these. Oh, can I not split stack? There we go. Two of these. We'll keep the starred meat. Take that. Sell one of those. Because I don't know what to keep right now. So three of those. And I don't know. Sell these? Sure. 201. That's enough money. So now I just kind of have to wait it out, right? Okay. Deposit all this. Don't need it. How much stuff? Oh, 400. Okay, wow. Let's go back out. Let's go back hunting. Uh, it's my... Actually, we can finish some quests now that we have enough money to do the other stuff. These are dry. I need to water these. <laughs> they kind of... They look really gross when wet. I don't know. They look really weird. <laughs> I don't know if I like it. Alright, let's fill this up. Fully dunk myself in water, give myself a bath. And let's go to Ani. We'll hunt and fish on the way to Ani, wherever he is. And we'll work on the other quest until, I guess, 14 minutes pass. I'm assuming they're talking about real time minutes? Maybe? I mean, that's a long time. Too many shiny pebbles. Friendly fisherman thinks they're perfect present. Ooh. All right. Let's find a knee. <laughs> Boink. Boink. Oh, I'm hunting. I don't care. Nice. 
sweet Mitha. Hello, people. Hello, hello. Goodbye. Hello. Oh, I thought you were tea posing for a second. Okay. Alright, he's here. Hey, Ani. Oh, wow. <laughs> Didn't expect you. Yeah? Caught some bugs. Ooh. Great job. I wish I had some kind of reward for you. Uh, how about this? Mom packed me too big of a lunch and I couldn't finish it. Mm, that's really really uh, that's not really a great reward, huh? Uh, yeah. I suggest you check your mail later. But the real reward is the fun you had learning to catch bugs. Am I right? Uh, sure, Ani. Thanks for your your leftovers. All right, let's talk to Reth. Ooh, there's some bugs here. So how do I get more smoke bombs? Is it craftable too? I'm assuming they're craftable as well. Come on. There we go. Mm, boof! Nice. No star butterfly yet. Sad. One day I'll get a star. It's crazy that I got a star at the beginning. I wonder if that was like intentional programming or not. He's not in here. See in this building? Yep. Aw. No much to do, so little time. Hey you! I grilled some mushrooms. Nice work. A bit more practice and you'll be making your own soup soon enough. But hey, I wouldn't mind if you kept stopping by for mine. In fact, here's a free sample. Aw, it's on the house. Thank you. While well, you can never go wrong with my vegetable soup, I might also suggest the fish stew. It could give you the extra boost you need to reel in the perfect catch. Got my hands full right now. Oh cool, so like food just have buff buffs? That's nice. Obtain the recipe for a stone smelter at Hodari. I know, but I'm like so broke right now. I have to wait for my monies to roll in. Will it just like automatically roll into my pocket? I'm assuming so. Like, I'm assuming I don't have to go and pick it up. Okay, well, I guess I'll just fill up my inventory. Could do a little fishing. Is there fishing here? Mm, oh, there's this one hole. Wonder, can I catch it up here? Can I actually catch up here? Oh! I- Oh no, he won't let me. I thought it was going to try fishing in a more opium area. No! Whoa! Okay, so don't swim. Got it. Swimming is not in this game. We are hydrophobic. We also have such good posture. Jeez. I'm a hunter, man. One. Two. Three. Nope. There we go. You can't get away from me. I actually know how to fish now. A channel catfish and it's a starred. <gasps> yeah, fishing level two. Is there like a fishing tree? What do I do if I'm level two? Also, it says, is there someone to talk to me here? What is this little bubble? This. I don't know. I want to fish this and then I'll go chase the bubble. Can I reach it over here? I mean, our, we cast far. Gee, <laughs> look at that. So if we're in the same server and there's fishing like this, I guess, do we share the same, like, fishing bubbles? I guess I would assume so. Ah, oh, dang it. Did I mess it up? No, it's still there. Is it gonna- am I too far? One. There we go. A two. Three. There we go. Ooh. I got it, I got it, I got it! You doing a last minute jump? <laughs> Spotted bullhead! Oh, that one's a cool looking fish. Is my inventory full? No. I got two starred ones that time. I'm gonna have an aquarium. Oh, I fell. 
I'm gonna have a freaking aquarium when I'm uh, done with this. So who's over here wanting to talk to me? I don't... Is it even getting bigger? It doesn't look like it is. Hello? Oh, this place is cool. What is this, like a school? I'm so confused. Oh, is it him? Because he wanted to talk to us about fishing. Oh, it's so him! Oh, okay, cool. I actually did want to meet him. He's like all over the page. What is this? Lures, trophies, fish stains. That's cool. Hey! This water looks gross. Disgusting, actually. You fish here? Humans call me Einar. Einar. Oh, hello. You seem to be another new person. Unless I have previously made your acquaintance. In which case, my apologies for forgetting you. I am often too distracted by my oneness to take uh, such n to take notice of such things as meeting new people. And there seem to be so many new people lately. What is the oneness? Silly human. The oneness is really the oneness. The oneness cannot be learned by listening to the sound of air as it moves through your face flaps. Face flaps? <laughs> it must be experienced. For me, that experience usually involves much fishing. Oh gosh, his eyes are kind of creepy. Um, I got your letter. Uh, you must have received my communications regarding the beloved pastime of fishing. I understand it is customary for tutelage, tutelage? to require work uh, that one does from home. I know there's a word for it, but I cannot quite recall what it is. Here. Why don't you give that fishing rod on your person a try? I shall be here in case you accidentally fall in. Aww. Okay. There are many ways to gather insects for bait. You can purchase them from the shop, find them in the woods, or even build your own worm farm. Ooh. Personally, I suggest the latter, as worms not only make great bait, but they also have an other excellent uses. You may keep them as pets or wear them as hats and other sorts of adornments. At least... This is what I do. <laughs> He's so cute. He's adorable. Okay, I'll fish with you. Uh, there's no fishing spots here, though. At least, not ones that I see. Am I supposed to fish with you? Uh, quest. Mm, how do I look at my quest again? This is not news. No. Uh, quest, quest, O, P, P is person, L, no, how do I, where is, I'm, am I actually, oh, this is quest, oh, I was scrolled at the bottom, catch a fish, okay, there's no fishing spots here, oh, there's one right there, okay. Uh, boink. Am I gonna get another star? I hope so. There we go. Oh, this fish is easy. This fish is easy. The fish is small, too. The fish is very small. Look at that puny little thing. It is a star! It's actually really pretty. A gilly fin. I caught one! You proud of me? You have navigated safely to the docks. This is wonderful news. Are you aware of how the exchange of goods is performed between two willing parties? I'm pleased to inform you that I now have a recipe shop where you may engage in that exchange with me. Oh, oh, there's a worm farm. Fishing level four. Jeez. Oh, and I could just sell stuff to you? Oh, 70 gold! <gasps> Minor rod health booster slightly increases the fishing rod health when equipped. Hmm. Standard rod. Okay, so I need to definitely level up and all that schnez. Caught a fish! Congratulations! I hope you were able to experience the same joy as I derived during such events. 
However, my time with humans taught me your kind derives limited utility from living fish. Perhaps this is a more suitable reward for your efforts. I do hope you will choose to continue this wonderful activity in the future. In the meantime, if you have anything I believe will be of interest to you, uh, I shall have it delivered to you via mail. Go and think your <laughs> He's adorable. He's so peaceful. So serene. Uh, I need to go home. What? Okay, so it's time. Alright, so I need to walk home. Fine. How far is it? Not too far. This is a really, really, really cool game. I wish I- I really do wish now I played a little bit sooner. Um, I wonder if there's anything that's gonna be like limited time things. Not like uh, how the bugs work right now where it's like day and night because obviously it's just like day and night switches fairly fast. But more like, is there like events that I've missed? I know there's like Founders DLC I think I might have missed, which is fine. I don't care. Cosmetic stuff. Um, but I hope I don't miss too much from here on. As long as I feel like I pay attention to the game. Which I'm most certainly going to do now because this game's really fun. I do think the ones who suggested it, I think it was Panda who suggested it, and then Shelly who suggested it, and uh, this is really fun. Okay, I need to store more stuff. I also need to put some fishies down. I'm not giving up on my aquarium dreams. Um, oh, that's food. Put that away. I'll sell... Okay, this... Oh, next shipment in zero minutes. Let's sell one of these and one of these. Cool. Yeah, let's put everything else away. Stop. What? Oh, that's my sales. <gasps> I have money. We can go buy the stuff now so I can upgrade my house. Can it? There we go. Waiting for it so I can click. And my outdoor aquarium is beginning. What fish is this? What, what, what fish are you? Striped dace. Okay. So now I have a striped dace. A catfish. Can I place it on top of each other? Oh, that's awesome. And a bullhead. I think I kind of want them like all looking a different way though. And this thing. Oh, oh I can't place it any higher. Dang it. Okay, I might do this. I might... Let's see. No, 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 no. I need to get used to these controls still. The aquarium is continuing. Like this. And then... I want this one to rotate. Like that. And then this one... Oh, I just have to tap it to toggle. Can go up here. <laughs> Look at that little guy. He's adorable. <laughs> he looks like he's in just constant shock. Cool. He's really cool. Got a catfish. Way better than what Animal Crossing was doing. Animal Crossing just had the poor little thing. I mean, same size tanks, right? Same size tanks. They're not really swimming around either. They're just kind of just there chilling. But I think this is... Still, I think this is a little bit cuter than what Animal Crossing was doing. Okay, let's check on the crops. Are they still moist? I think they're still pretty good. Alright, so let's go buy the recipes and work on our house. Singularity 6 will never ask for your password. Well, don't you kind of like have to for or maybe that's sort of scam wise i was gonna say like don't don't you kind of have to ask for my password to log into the game ruby celeste oh i thought she was really short i guess when you're running you kind of go in a slant okay so i need to go to um who do i need to go to see i need to go see ashura I sure has what I need. Oh, 
Oh, it's so peaceful. I feel like any screenshot of this game can end up like being like a wallpaper too. It's so nice. Uh, Ashura. Hello there, friend. Always nice to see you around. If you're looking to have a little fun, there's a lot of ways to enjoy yourself in the valley. I go fishing for fun. Ani goes exploring in the woods. Badru can sit and listen to music in the inn for hours. We have every sort of revelry yeah, here, no matter what your personal taste. You like. Okay, I need to open your store and get your sawmill. Okay, for axes, I need to level up my foraging. Mmm. Foraging metals. Dragon's beard peat. Ooh, forager's bonsai. Okay. And now I need to go talk to Hodari. 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 Where is Hodari? Hecla, Kaleri, Kenyatta, Zeki, Reth, Jell, Delilah. Where would Hodari be? Oh, that's their little farm. Okay. Hodari. I don't... I don't see a Hodari. That's Shane, Sifu, Hassian, Hecla, Kaleri. Who's behind Kaleri? Belusa, Zeki. Is he like in the mines somewhere? Is there like a mines I'm missing or a different town? Mm. I don't. It's a Bahari Bay. Where's Hodari? Oh, maybe I need mining level two first. Cause I don't know what mining level I am. What, how do I check my levels? Uh, here it is. I need to be mining level two. So let me just go punch some rocks and then um, level up for a little bit. If I can find some rocks around me. Oh my gosh, it's barren right now. Here we go. Mm, kind of want to find rocks with ore in them as well. Just so I can get a little step ahead. Don't see any rocks right now. Whoa! Oopsies. Also, how do you activate your glider? Maybe I don't have one yet? It doesn't look like I have one right now. Okay, that's fine. I need... Oh, do these have fruit on them? Oh, that's cool. A little apple orchard. Ice sprouts. Grasshopper. I am not seeing touchable rocks. Unless these rocks are touchable and I just haven't noticed. No. <laughs> not even this rock? No? Oh my gosh. Where do I look? Oh, those are cool. What are these? They kind of look like a uh, what Appa is from Avatar. Is this mineable? Oh my gosh, the quest to find a mineable rock. Jeez. Um. I keep running into little bugs. I don't see. Oh, don't kill me. No, I'm fine. Mm, this rock over here in the little corner. There we go. Ooh, copper ore. Okay. Any more of the little pebbles I have to mine? Not that 
I see. Whoa, what is that? Oh, that's the moth I need to catch, right? I have to catch this thing. Yeah, I think this is the Milani moth or something. Kalami moth. Nice. Okay, so that quest should be done now. If I didn't finish it already. There's a lot of things here. None of them are rocks. Mm. Okay, let's see what I'm looking for. Here we go. They're so small, it's so hard to see. There we go. Gosh, I am a little bit of a ways away from getting a uh, mining level two. Is there like a mines or anything I can head towards? Like, what is this? Where am I? What happens if I go in here? Is this where I came from? What is this place? Is this where I came from and I just don't remember? I don't want to get myself stuck into something that I don't know about. Mm, I'm just trying to get some rocks, bro. Uh, that looks like a rock over there. Here we go. Nice! Silver ore! Ho oh, ho ho! Yes please! And thank you! Can I mine this rock? Oh, I can too. Even these big boy rocks. Silver, all that. Okay, so at least I found the sweet spot for stone. Oh, I'm clipping through. I can see the insides. There we go. Oops. Let me get this last rock. And then I will try to find... H Hodari. You unlocked. Okay. Cool. There's nothing I can do about that though, right? You're just gonna... Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Um... So where is Hodari? Shane... Tish, Breath, Kenley, Hassian. I mean, if this is to a different town, maybe he's over at the different town. Badru, Gina, because he's not here. Alright, I'll head to where these people are going, right? Let's go to Bahari Bay. Maybe he's at Bahari Bay? Where is... there it is. Princess Saucy. What a name. Do I have inventory space? I have a little bit of inventory space. I'm not gonna waste it on hunting or whatever. Oh, is that to it? That looks cool. Dude, there's so many deer. Do you ever get, like, mounts in this game? Are there even mounts in this game? I doubt, I guess. Mm, okay. Over here? Some materials, like cooking ingredients, can be purchased at the shop. Okay, cool. I wonder how hard it gets to get certain things, like certain materials. Alright, uh, is Hodari here? He is! Oh my gosh, he is. So this is like the second half of the map, I'm guessing. Oh my gosh, Hodari, dang bro! Hopefully your thing isn't expensive. Is that your house? Holy cow, you live in a mansion! 
Oh, are you eeping? Ah, oh, he's eeping. Can I wake him up? Is that a thing? Can you wake him up? Hodari, I'm in your house. Spanky Von Wonderhoven. Oh my gosh, what a name. You need a key to Hod from Hodar to enter. I usually work alone. Ah, heard you been putting in that pick I gave you to work. If you want to hone those skills, build yourself a smelter. First step is to turn rocks into bricks. I got a couple other recipes in stock that can help you too. Check them out. Okay, we just need this. And that's it, I think. We can't afford any of this either. Oh, those are cool. Alright, bye! How's that plot of land working out for you? It's doing great! Good. You need any tips? Just ask. Thank you. Okay, that's cool that you could just talk to him through the door. Can we return home? No. Nope. Oh, what is this? A little dog house? I mean, that's a big dog house. Alright, so now I gotta build and place my stone smelter and probably my wood panel maker thingy, too. Really cool how someone made up the comp concept of doing an MMO of this type of game. I would think it would be like very hard to be done just for the fact of resource sharing, but if every um, if every load you're in, you join a new server, it does refresh it for you basically, which is really nice. All right, I'll just kind of run home. So, fun. Um, let's see. Can I go? Can I return home? Three, two, one. There we go. Alright. Let's make that wood cutter. Let's make that stone smelter. And then we're cooking gas. Then we can actually get the materials we need to build the house. Because we're going to need so much. So much. Way more than I, uh, than I thought we were going to. Okay, cool. Let's see, how much does it cost? Do I even have the materials? For a basic sawmill, I need to get 10 more wood, which is nothing. And then, nope. And then for the smelter, I need to get more Cernuk hides. Okay, and Cernuk are the deer, if I remember right. So let's get what we need for this, build that, and then I'll go out hunting for some Cernuk. Which, honestly, hunting in this game is really, really fun. So I'm not even mad that I sold some of my hides. I didn't know what they were used for. But, um, hunting's fun in this game. I actually really enjoy it. It's very satisfying. Very easy and simple. Can I cut down this tree? No. <laughs> it's not even making the hit noise or anything. Here we go. Uh, I think one more tree. Is this even a tree? It kind of looks like a bush. One more will do it. Cool. Actually, that barely gave me anything. That was definitely a bush. There we go. Nice. Okay. So, we need to... Craft. I'll shove it over here in this corner. Uh, I don't really want it anywhere else. How much plank? So one for one. That's not bad at all. That was a lot better than I was expecting. I thought it was going to be like, oh, you need like five for one. So let me just turn all this in. No, wait, I'm selling this. I don't want to sell that. Holy cow, I don't want to sell that. I'm at the store. <laughs> Why does this cost so much? Onyx. The perfect stone for crafting creepy doll eyes. <laughs> a rare star stone beloved by those born under the sign of the Watcher. It sells for a very high price. Okay, cool. Uh, Let's put that away. We don't need that. We don't need that. Uh, how do I put this away? I just want it all... Just, just... There we go. And then I'll sell the rest of these flowers. And then let's go hunting. Nice. 90 for those flowers. Okay, cool. Make a good chunk of change with that one. Do, 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 do. 
Loadings aren't that bad either. You should eat to get some focus to help you level up faster. Ooh, okay, also welcome. <laughs> I see this is your first time here. I do have food in my house. I'll go, I can go grab some, a couple snackies. Cause uh, that bar is like a XP booster, right? I didn't think it was, I guess, as important. But if you suggest it, then uh, I don't mind trying it. It's just to fill it up. You can sell gems for money, can't do anything with them. Oh, really? Also, welcome Milan too. Look at that, two new people. Hi guys, <laughs> welcome in. Hope you guys are well. Um, okay. So you're saying I should sell this onyx. Cool, I'll be rich, I don't care. Um, I'll eat this. I don't know how much my focus bar totals out to. So let's, okay, 100 fills it up basically halfway. Do I got any more snackies? That's for 50. Oh no, I don't wanna do that. Well, I guess I can hold this with me. All right, cool, so we'll eat that. That's how high I'll go. And I'll sell this, like you said, guys said. I mean, it doesn't say it's used for crafting. And if anything, I could just, if I really need another one, if it, if you guys are joking with me or whatever, then I could just find another one. Not too bad about that. But hey, money's money. It's good that, I thought money was gonna be really hard to get for some reason. But um, yeah, welcome. <laughs> Nice to have you guys here and giving me tips because I truly know nothing about this game. I, uh, some people I talked to suggested it to me, um, in my Twitch suggestions and so I thought I'd try it out today. And so far it's been really fun. I like the hunting the most, I think. The hunting and the fishing are, I think, the most enjoyable right now for me. Alright, so for some deer, I... Oh, is that one down there? No, that's a person. <laughs> okay. Let's see, down here. I think I found deer this way. Uh, how many arrows do I got? I got seven arrows. I really need to craft more arrows. All right, uh, not too bad. I just need to count my shots. Maybe over here. I also just realized running is a toggle, which is so nice. I thought I had a hold on to it. Here we go. Ooh, I caught him in the leg. I need to aim way higher. Oh boy. Oh boy, you guys are like standing right next to each other. Nice. Oh, the bag is over here. Alright, that's one hide. Let's grab these mushrooms as well. And let's focus on you. Okay, I'm assuming it's this one. The tree kind of threw me off. Oh, he's running. He is zooming. Where are you going? Jeez, buddy. Calm down. No, that's not worth it. Man, it's a zooming. There we go. Nice. Alright, let's get one more. I'll get one more just in case. I mean, you're right in front of me. You were asking for it. I was gonna get your buddy, but you were totally asking for it. Okay. You're in the water. What happens if I shoot you while you're in the water? I don't see a baggie. Do I just lose out on materials? Aw, do I, did I screw myself over? I don't see a baggie. Oh, there's one right here. Okay, cool. You got... cool. That was my 10th kill, I guess. And home is not far, so we'll just run home. It's not like I can teleport anyways. <laughs> it's cool that they give you a teleporting option, at least. Let's say if you're out and about really far away. That's uh, really handy. But I really, really, really should um, 
craft more arrows. I need to figure out how to do that for sure before I even think about hunting again. Nice. Okay. Um, so let's craft smelter. Crops still look wet, which is good. And let's put the smelter right, oh, right there. That's fine. Okay, so two stone for one brick, which isn't too bad. Now let's put this away. Let's put the meat away. And, oh, hey. Have you seen my hat? It's on my I've seen you've been quite busy around here. That's very good, very good. So, uh, do you have anything for me? Like what? Like a housewarming gift? <laughs> Why am I giving you a gift? Uh, I think you have it backwards. Is that not how humans do it? How strange. Well, here in Kilima, when someone new moves into the neighborhood, they go around with small gifts for their new neighbors, snacks and toys and the like. If you ever want to be invited to one of my wife's dinner parties, I suggest making the rounds. So I have to go give gifts? Uh, copper arrows, one shot, level one Cernox? Ooh, so I need to get more copper in my life. Right now I don't have the recipe for copper, but I'll definitely look into that. Uh, arrows. Okay, arrows aren't too bad. What is this, flint? Yeah, flint and wood. Uh, I definitely need to cut down a lot of trees. I guess I'll cut down all the trees around here, because I'm going to need them anyways. So I have to give five gifts. What gifts do I give? Do I Can I give anything? Like, I think, like, can I give fish? Or mushrooms? Or flowers that I find? I don't know what people like. <laughs> What should I give? You guys got any suggestions? I have no idea. Alright, I'm not cutting that down. Because these just don't still even get wood. But yeah, I'll definitely look into some copper next time I'm out into the store. Hmm. Here we go. I guess I can give flowers. I think that's what I'll do. Flowers and morels that I find. Because there's a bunch of morels around here. I'll gift my favorite people. You can gift anything, it's just that the character likes it or not. Okay, so it's kind of like Stardew Valley vibe, uh, vibes. Or like, you can give something, it's just... Well, they're not, they're gonna hate you for it, so you can give, like, a rock or whatever. <laughs> it's so funny to get, uh, to see the characters in Stardew Valley get angry over giving them a rock. <laughs> sure, I'll give them mushrooms. They can handle my shrooms. I know I have to cut down a lot of this stuff. Um... Okay. I'm worried about how much time it's going to take to collect all the stone. For the wood, it's easy, but for the stone, I feel like it's going to be really annoying. Also, has my... It's... Yeah, it's been draining. If they don't like the gifts, they won't take it. Um, and I don't think it counts for your task. Aww! So I can't give them something that they hate. Okay, that makes... That makes sense. That... That... That makes sense. Even though it's a pain in the butt. So it's just learning what they like. I don't want to look it up. Even though you could probably easily do that by now. Um, I'll definitely... I won't give them trash, let's say. I just won't give them trash. I'll be nice. Uh, any other small trees around here? There we go. There's a lot of stone around here too. I should definitely get that later. Alright, that's more than enough. 
if you ask me. This little tree will be the last one. There we go. Okay. So, I need to craft, I think with this, it says I need to make a hundred sapwood planks. Which is a hundred of these. Right? How do I... Does that do it? I think that does it. Okay. That's working. Nice. And now I'm going to use the rest of my wood to make arrows. Oh, I can make a whole lot. I'll make... How many do I have in my pocket right now? Um, you know what? It doesn't matter. I'll just make as much as I can. Um, so, 12. Nice. Okay. That's a lot of arrows. I didn't realize that. <laughs> Holy cow, I just made so many arrows. These look good. Do they need watering? No, they're fine. Okay, cool. Alright, let's head into town and woo the village. It's my inventory... How's my inventory space looking? It's looking alright. Oh yeah, I also want to look into... One makes 20? Oh my gosh, it does. Oh, what's this? Clay? Ooh, do I mine clay? I totally did not realize one makes 20. I just... I'm set, you know? I'm set. So do I mine to make clay? How do I get clay? Because I'm going to need to make some bug bombs soon enough. You mine? Okay. So I just have to probably mine, I'm assuming, rocks by the water? Because that's the only thing that makes the most sense. Cool. Um, let's see. So let me find... What, where can I, where do you think would be the great, I'll try going around here maybe, maybe there'll be rocks around the fisherman's lagoon. Oh, and there's flowers here. Yeah, see I can get these flowers and use them as gifts. Because who wouldn't want a sun drop lily? They're so pretty and they glow. Um, I could get a bug for Ani. I feel like Ani would really like bugs. Ani? Uh, very cool. That will be for Ani. And it's not a star. Yeah, around there and along the coast. Okay, cool. So, I will check here and then I'll check around the coast if I don't find enough. So many flowers. Here we go. So, da -da -da. what is that? Is that a chest? Is this a chest? Huh, flour, cooking oil, and a pirate treasure chest. What do I do about this? No, I don't stop. What do I do about the treasure chest? Oh. So that's like decor. Okay. Also, my inventory is immediately full since traveling. <laughs> Great. This has to be clay. Yeah, look at that. That's so clay. Oh, my inventory's full. What's the what's the one that's full? Nothing. There's no thing. Your next purchase should be the 500 coin backpack upgrade for sure. Yeah. How much money am I rocking? $33. <laughs> yeah, I need to totally upgrade. Um, upgrade out of the wazoo. Alright, that looks good. So I have, I'm assuming, enough. So let's go, let's start gifting people. Um, let's gift our little fisherman guy. Once I start gifting, my inventory should let up by at least one. Hey, buddy. I have crafted many adornments I made from fishing implements. I find them quite aesthetically pleasing, but I do sometimes wonder if I'm the only being who feels this way. Aww. What do you think of my adornments? They're charming! This pleases me. I shall remember you find my adornments charming. Aww. Okay, how do I gift? This way? Oh, tell me, how much does a can can cantankerous koi taste? 
a lot. The gem you sold should be 500. Oh, so I basically just have to wait for that to come in. Congratulations, that is good news. No? It is not desirable for food to have much taste. I want to give you... a morel. No, thank you. Okay, I want to give you a flower. No, thank you. Uh... What do you want? I have nothing else that you want. You want a pirate chest? No, thank you. What is this? Hmm, I've been looking for a particular rye eyeless minnow to act as a companion. Let me know if you spot one. Okay, so I have to fish. I don't have the inventory. <laughs> I do want to give Buddy Boo a bug. Where's Ani? I want to give Ani a bug. There he is. Let me go get Ani. He likes any fish? Alright, I'll give him a fish next time. It's just that my inventory's full. <laughs> so I just have to wait for that money to come through. I guess uh, you could say like that's like, I guess, one downside maybe. Is um, you have to wait for money. Especially when you're in the beginning trying to get money. I need- whoa. Who are you? Another human. This vi the vi this village is practically becoming overrun. I'm sure you want to talk to me about securing a house housing permit. Don't I have one? Oh. Well, it's nice to want things. I want the crown jewels of Aquindu, but you don't see me prancing around in a tiara. If you need someone to hold your hand, talk to my dim-witted husband. Please only disturb me if you have important matters to discuss. Can I give you a flower? What made you think I would enjoy this? Alright, you're interesting. You can directly sell your items at Zeki's store too if you don't have to wait. Oh, okay. I have to get used to all these new things I'm learning. I have a feeling this is going to be a great day. Does it sell for the same price too? I want to give you a flower. Or a bug. Awesome, I've been running all over trying to find one of these. I guess I have to get, uh, I guess I'll have to get my exercise elsewhere from now on. Okay, cool. Oh, so it does sell for the same? Nice. I'll definitely look into that then. I just opened it. It's just that treasure chest totally blocked up my inventory. Also, what? who wants to talk to me in here? Not in here? Who wants to talk to me? Is it the mayor? Who is that? Ashuru. Oh, I know where you are. You should be behind your desk? Did I just pass you up? No. Are you upstairs? Asharu. <gasps> there it is. Push-ups. Oh, Asharu. Uh, Ashura. I keep saying Asharu. I'm an idiot. It's good to see you embracing foraging. My son and I used to do it all together all the time. I think you're ready for this new recipe I've got in stock. Cool. Uh, are you talking about the eggs? Because I'm broke. I'm poor. <laughs> You're not getting anything from me. Can I gift you a mushroom? You like foraging, you just said? Ah, there we go. I've, I've been looking for one of these. How'd you know? Cool. Alright, enjoy your push-ups. Good on him. Getting his daily health in. Alright, who else do I have goodies for? don't know. Um, let's look in here. Zeki? Is this the guy you guys were talking about? I'm assuming we could sell here. Ah, uh, yep. You're right. You guys are always right. Can I sell <laughs> my arrows? I made too many. Zeki, what if I give you a flower? I'm not getting any younger here. <laughs> Welcome to the general store, pal. If you're looking to buy, we got vegetables, seeds, and fertilizer. We've got that pointy stick over there that kind of looks like a rake. <laughs> All your basic farming who's its and what's its. Can I give you a gift? Can I give you a flower? Hey. Trying to impress me? Well, you gotta try a lot harder than this if you want. Okay, I'll go fish. I'll go find a fishy. Sorry. Furball. Ew, <laughs> you could do a furball. Um, all right, the river's over here. We'll fish and we'll give our robot friend a gift. How often can you gift? Can you like gift multiple times? Or is it like one per in-game day? 
No fishing spots here. Oh, there's a fishing spot over there, though. Scooby, Scooby tree in the way. And let's get this. Oh gosh, the cast, <laughs> the cast is so fast. I can barely see it. I think that will work fine. Cause the water levels are bouncing up and down. One, two, three. Did I miss it? No way, I clicked! What? Okay, well, we have another chance. Let's go around. Let's go around and try to catch this fish. No one saw that. It's fine. Oh. Mm, there we go. Alright, one last time. Oh, my cat's crying. Is that gonna... Is that gonna bite it? There we go. One. Two. There we go. Oh, this looks like a bullhead. Is this a bullhead? You can't. Ooh. There we go. Spotted bullhead. I think we already have one of these um, at home, so I won't keep this buddy. He will go to our beautiful fishing friend. Also, I don't know what I'm doing with these flowers. I don't, I'm assuming these flowers are maybe for crafting or designing in the future. But I'm going to collect them anyways because they're really pretty. This. Is this? This is not to where I want to go. I'm going the complete opposite way. He's over here. Dude, I need to get used to this map. <laughs> I thought I had it too. I was like, oh, I'm so impressed. I can uh, figure out where I'm going. Nope, not yet. <laughs> I still don't even know where my house is. But it's good that uh, you can do waypoints and all that. It's a very common gameplay thing, obviously, but it's really nice still. Also, when do I get to glide? I see people gliding all the time. That's... it's pretty here. Is there like a, do I have my glide or do I have to like earn it via quests? I'm assuming it'll teach me at some point, like, through a quest or whatever. Because I haven't gotten a tutorial for it. Wink. Oh, my tooth. There we go. Hello. Earn it through a quest? Okay. So I just have to keep progressing. Cool. Humans are both ancient and new at the same time. Fascinating. You're so adorable. I have a fish for you. This has a pleasing shape. Thank you. Pleasing shape? <laughs> what does that mean? A pleasing shape. Okay. So, that is three out of five. I wonder, will Tish like a flower? I'm thinking, is Tish the one... Is Tish a flower person? I know I could probably gift meals. I don't want to do that. That's like a waste in my eyes. Oh, Tish. Oh, yes, yeah, she is. Ooh, okay. So that's another gift. Um, ready. So I just got to figure out who I'm giving what for the last one. A blink. Oh, that dress is pretty. That player's got a really pretty dress on. <gasps> Tish! Oh, wow, that sink is really pretty. Oh. I thought they were gonna change, like, 24-hour periods, not, like, in-game days. Oh, that's so cool. That... F that freaking... This thing, though. Oh, my gosh. That's so modern and so sleek. Oh, there she is. Look at that pretty dress. Very nice. Hey, Tish. Can I interest you in furniture? Can I interest you in a flower? Oh, these are perfect. Did you pick them for me? Of course. I heard you can sometimes find ship fragments when fishing in the ocean. 
I love to make some furniture out of reclaimed wood. Bye. Reclaimed wood. Okay. Alright, let's look at the map. Let's inspect. Esh, I'm not dealing with. Kenley, mm, Reth, Shane, huh, Hassian, Hodari's on his way. Is there anything I could give Hodari? Can I give, actually, can I give him an arrowhead? What would he do? Would he find it useful at all or would he be like, this sucks, I make better? Let's see. Only one way to find out. I was assuming like giving him skins or something would be of use for him. Hassian. Speak your business. I have a gift. Arrowhead. Ah, mm. oh, there we go. It pleases me that you've come to appreciate the Majiri customs of gift giving. Mm. My quiver is nearly worn through. Do you think you can find me a spotted chapa tail to mend it? That was do these quests that they're giving me, like, just stay around? Like, do they... They're not even here, actually. Are they just, like, random things? Like, how do I keep tabs on that? I don't... That's fine. Whatever. We'll worry about that later, I guess. Return to Kenley. Okay. But yeah, like, they keep asking for stuff, but I don't... Where would I... I guess see that or pay attention to that. Where is Kenley? He's in this building. There are weekly likes you can see on the heart tab. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, let me look at that. Weekly likes? Ah, oh, weekly wants. So, like this. Eyeless minnow. Okay. Oh, and they like, they gift you different things. Oh, very, very cool. So I guess you give, okay. That, uh, that's very nice for the live stuff. Also, this character is very pretty. Sup, so, you're new, right? I'm Kenyatta, glorified city hall receptionist. My parents run this place. If you have a problem, you should probably go to one of them. But if you want to get up into some trouble, hit me up. She's cool, cool. Um, so is he upstairs? Yep. Hey, Kenley. Good to see you. I've given some housewarming gifts. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Giving presents is the best way to get to know people. Everyone has their own taste, of course. Uh. Esh has always liked the finer things. My, the sheer number of presents I gave her when we first began courting. Ah, you've made everyone feel welcome. I'm not sure what you like yet, but it's, it's but the least I can do is give you a little something as well. Goodbye. Cool. My inventory's full. <laughs> Okay, so now I could just go home. Oh, she's right here. Now I could just go home and probably just work on crafting. Put some stuff away, work on some crafting, work on the house. I feel like that's a good good step ahead. Whoa, Ashura, what are you doing here? Are you just here? How's your day going? Howdy, I hear you got the community on your side. It's not e an easy task, but you've been so helpful around here lately, it's no wonder they accepted you so quickly. Anyway, about that housewarming gift, I brought you some bricks and some planks for your house. Aww, if you need any more, um, you can always buy them from Sifu, the blacksmith, or you can make your own using the sawmill smelter. My inventory is so full. <laughs> um, let's put this away. Just put that away. Um, put this, this, this. What is this? Grilled oyster, yummy. Uh, put that away. Let's put the flowers away. All right, I should be good now. How are these doing? It's gonna take a long time, I see. It's gonna take a long, long time. And then these require two rocks, and how many do I need to make for the house? 35. Okay, so I need to get 70 rocks. Okay. I have a lot of here, a lot of rocks here that I can mine out, so I'm not too worried about that. And then I'll get that all ready up and then I'll try, uh, I don't know. I don't know where we would find that minnow. I might have to look that up or something. Because I don't want to constantly be fishing in like the wrong spot and waste time. And then she wants like a product of fishing. 
Some sort of wood? Is that like by like tr uh, pirate chest or something? Oh, I got a gem. What is this gem? What is this? Citrin, citrin, sit down and stare at this rock for hours. A rare a rare star stone beloved by those born under the sun. Okay. That one sells for even more. Oh. Okay. You get more rocks. Actually, how are my crops doing? They look in they're dry. Let me water these for sure. mining we're at 30 so 40 more or basically at 30 we're at 29 this game is way cooler than i thought it was going to be i thought it was going to be more like oh since like a lot of people are playing you're not going to be able to get many resources so this is a uh, a lot better than what i expected okay that doesn't work You get a good amount of resources from mining and all that. Instead of just like two per rock or whatever. Getting a good old chunk. Nice. And these rocks are too big. Oh, what's that back there? What's the what what's happening back here? What's this like mining cart? Uh Huh. Okay. Interesting. Maybe one day we get to open that up or something. Also, can we fish in these ponds? It doesn't look like it. Alright, one or two more rocks should do it. I think I'll definitely be hunting. <laughs> I need to get some get rid of some of these arrows. Alright, one more rock. Papa! Why are you crying? Nice. Okay. Um so let's make 35. It's a good thing you don't need coal or anything like that either. That will take a while. So what? Two minutes for one and 35. So I'm definitely not building the house today. <laughs> if it's going to take over an hour for it to be done. I'm not planning on staying on that long. I'll do a little bit more. Maybe find that minnow. Actually, I'll look that up now. What area I can find that minnow. I'll fish that out. And then, um, and then I'll most likely stop there. Because now all I'm doing is just waiting, right? And I'm assuming that it will just do it on its own in the background. Like, when I close out the game. Because I feel like that makes the most sense. Unless I have to stay on the game for an hour. Which, I don't, I don't think so. Kind of cool that you can craft and just go away from it. You don't have to be there, though. The entire time. Okay, so I'm looking for... If I go to the hearts tab, and we're gonna play with our friend Heck, not Hecla. Yeah, it runs in the back. Okay, cool. So I don't have to deal with that. He wants an eyeless minnow. Eyeless minnow. I just want to figure out the general location of it. It's a cave thing. Wait, nope. Location: Bahari Bay or Kilima Village. Doesn't really say. Wait, it says caves. Is there a cave? There's a cove. Uh, Bahari Bay. Housing plot. Dragon Shrine. Phoenix Falls. Is there a cave somewhere? 
I see a cove. Does Bahari Bay got some caves going on? Do you kind of have to like stumble in these caves? I see no cave, uh, I see no cave entrance anywhere from when I was playing. Let's hit, maybe Bahari Cove's got like a cave that stands out. Not Kilima, but Bahari, yeah. Okay, so we'll go to Bahari. So I wonder why this says Kilima. Hm. I don't trust them now. <gasps> we got a starred mountain morale. Oh my gosh, is my inventory full? If I eat, I'll be fine. I got stuff to eat, so let me do that. Oop, don't fall. Yeah, I got I got an okay amount of inventory space. Oop, what was that, bug? Ooh, I should have made more bug smoke too. Dang, I keep forgetting. <laughs> it's fine. How much bug smoke do I have? Seven? Eh, I'll worry about it next time. I go home. If I remember. <laughs> I need to just start like having like a sticky note just says like when you go home make more stuff because I keep forgetting every single time and it says it doesn't require any bait so I should be able to get it and it's common so I should be able to get it I'm not trying to look too much into everything around it just where I can find it so I'm not lost because I totally would have just fished in that lake that's next to that guy <laughs> I won't lie. I would have been dumb. Okay, a cave, grove, cove. Are coves caves? Shores. Like, is that a cave? That's an entrance that leads somewhere. Grove. Like, what are, like, what is this? Where is this leading to? I'm gonna check that out. Oh. Mari the cat lady. Hello. Whoa. That's cool. Are these like new little buddies? You're not spotted, so you're not what I was. It's in the Pavel Mines. Pavel Mines, Windy Ruins. Oh! Right here. Oh, I totally like was disregarding the giant letters on the map. I was totally not reading that. Okay, cool. At least I know where to go now. Uh, do I have to go up this bridge? I don't think I do. Also, I- yeah. I mean, your tail's not spotted. You're a little zigzaggy. You're cute, though. I wish you could tame them. Uh... I feel like I have to go up. Do I have to go up? I sh yeah, I do. Okay, um, I guess I'll go around. There's no other way I can see. Like here? Nope, I gotta go. Wait, how do I go up? Am I lost? <laughs> I'm so confused. This place is way... It has a lot of different altitudes. I try. I it's there's an entrance at the bottom. Ah, oh, dang! <laughs> Look how far! Oh my gosh! All I probably had to do was just get around it. Oh my gosh! I all I had to do was just get around it. I'm so dumb. <laughs> you know what, Bevmu? Bevmu, thank you. <laughs> Without you, Bevmu, I would have made this a lot longer and more aggravating to watch than it should have been. <laughs> You too, Milan, because you both are really, really helping right now. Because I am... I have no idea. I see it. Is this it? Is... This looks like it. This... This is it. Yeah! Okay, cool. Now we're in it. In it. Um, oh, that's floating. So, where to find water? I'm assuming my map doesn't... Yeah, my map doesn't show. Oh, that's water, but I don't think that's water we need to fish in. Could this be it? No, because this is out of the mines. Yeah, that would make no sense. Mm, 
Okay. Let's go here. Nothing. Also, I'm not really seeing rocks <laughs> that you can mine. Oh, here we go. I got a couple fishing spots. Alright. Don't screw it up, Vanessa. Don't screw it up. Alright, that got it. There we go. Two. Three. Boink. Oh, you're tiny. You look like something I might want. Oh, you're so puny. Oh gosh, I'm looking away. I was minnow! Oh, it's starred too. Oh, I want to keep it if it's starred. Let's fish this back one and see what we get. Maybe we'll get another eyeless minnow and be lucky. There we go. Two. Three. Nice. Oh, this is another one. Cool. Because I definitely want to keep all the starred fish I get and the starred bugs just for the fun of it. My nice little museum I'll make. Oh, I got two starred. So starred must be not, not be as rare as I think it should be. Okay, let's go back. Can I travel home? No. <laughs> Alright, we'll walk to him. It's also really cool and really funny how you can just like climb on the rocks and on walls. Like, <laughs> I think that's a, uh, it's so quirky. Am I going the right way? I think I am. Yeah, just need to go down a little bit more. I'll definitely um, probably do another stream of this game because this was really fun to try out. I don't know when I'll do it. Maybe Friday if I don't get any other suggestions. Um, game suggestions, I'll probably do it again on Friday. Because this has been really enjoyable. Really peaceful too. I also need to work on Knuckle Sandwich too. Knuckle Sandwich has been so much fun. Yesterday I played that way longer than I thought I was ever going to. <laughs> uh, and it was really fun. Such a quirky game, Knuckle Sandwich is. And that's like, I think, my first game other than like Pokemon that kind of has a fight style like that. Which is, um, which is really cool. I've always been wanting to try games that have uh, the fight style like Knuckle Sandwich does when it comes to like choosing fight items or any of that. And I barely would play them. What's it called? Like RPG or turn-based? Yeah. Um, I've always wanted to try those. And Knuckle Sandwich just makes it so much better because obviously they're kind of just like... I don't know what they're doing. It's like RPG turn-based but on, <laughs> on steroids. On goofy parody steroids. <laughs> it's so much fun. It's gonna make standards for me in other turn-based games so much higher because of the comedic relief they do and all the little mini games they do. Uh, buddy, I got your I got your mino. Do you wish to engage in conversation? I do. How do I? Farewell. Oh, do I have to wait? Is this something like I have to gift give? You've already given this villager a gift for today. Ah, so I probably have to wait, I guess, tomorrow. Oh, bye. bye. <laughs> Alright, let me see if I can... I'll go and uh, make some more stuff and collect a stone brick and then... And then we'll see. Because I obviously have a quest there that says it. Oh, actually, you guys can't see my... Oh, no, you guys can see my quest.
Mm, is that an easier way to go up? Is this an easier way to go up? I think it is. Yeah, it kind of is. Also so pretty. So pretty how you get to walk under like these trellises and all that. I definitely like the art style of this game. It's not too realism. I like how a lot more games are actually pushing for this style. Because, like, what, games like Sims and all that do try to do... Well, not anymore for Sims 4, but they used to do, like, what, high uh, realism. And it's nice that they uh, are taking more of, like, a cartoony animation approach. I love it. Oh, you're so cute! <laughs> Look at you! <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so creepy. You're like a zombie. Um, can I collect one of these? Take that. Nice! Okay, is that- is that it? Also, why is my mailbox glowing? I have a lot of mail. <laughs> Dear Nesta, just to keep getting better better- Ask you to stop by later and I'll teach you how to build a better one. Uh, ooh, money! Heard you set up a smelter. Good job! Esha's got a program she set up to encourage investing in Kilima's infrastructure or something. Anyways, all right, rebate, cool. Rebate, cool. Dear Nesta, you've been using that pick I gave you if you want to learn more about the real life miner. Okay, so you're just telling me you have a store. You gave me something. Makeshift herb planter. Oh, I know, I love you. I put the encasement inside and noticed a small bit of sun consuming life growing inside several days later. It's determination and newness to the world remind me of you. Oh. I know her again. Zeki. Okay, tire going out. Oh, let me go expand my backpack. Just met you, but you only person I asked. Something strange happening. Okay. Ooh, recipes. Yes, please. Ani gives me a picnic blanket. Cool. Sifu. What? A rug. Oh. Ashura and China. Ancient thing. Oh, that looks like the thing with the battery. My inventory is so full. Okay, can I put some stuff down? Oh, that's so nice. I'll put it back here. Yeah. And I got a rug, right? I don't think I have much to do with this rug. It'll be... I can't put a rug here. I was gonna say, it could be my little entryway rug. I'll put my rug over here. This will be my workspace rug. And then, what is this? A little boot. I'll put my boot here, and now I got more stuff. Nope, that's all of it. So when the mailbox is glowing, that's a good sign. All right, talk to Gina about the Phoenix Shrine and try the battery on the door behind the waterfall. Purchase Zeki's. Yeah, let me go get the backpack. I'll definitely do that. Sucks that it takes so long for um for the materials to go though I totally would have continued uh, that end of it and decorated my house a little make it nice and pretty furniture in this game is really really cute too this is gonna make me like resent dreamlight valley's decorating <laughs> I know it for sure I've had people be like oh uh, dreamlight valley needs to do so much better because paleo does it really well and so now I'm just nervous <laughs> that that's what's going to happen to me. I'm going to be resent Dreamlight Valley. Be like, their decorating sucks. I want this. Because right now Dreamlight Valley's got, what, 90 degree furniture turning? Which is awful. <laughs> we definitely need at least 45. And this game's doing, it looks like less than 45. I might be wrong, though. Don't need to go in there. Where's this store? This store is here? Well, actually, is this store here? This doesn't look like his store. No, he's at the tavern. Can I shop with him while he's there, or do I have to go in his store? Anything fun okay, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm just going, <laughs> That's so funny. Um, that's the mayor's building. It's over here. This is it. 
Here we are. Backpack. Wow, you just got more space. Keep saving to expand your bag further. Five thousand? <laughs> Five thousand. That's a whole lot of buckaroonies, if you ask me. But cool, so now we have three bars, which is, oh my gosh, so much better. Luxury. Luxury at best. Alright, but I'll leave it here. This was so much fun. I really enjoyed it. Um, way more than I thought I was actually going to. I enjoyed this way, 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 way more than I thought I was going to. So I'll probably do another stream of this if I don't get any more um, suggestions. By the way, I keep saying that. Um, I might as well let you know. For YouTube chat suggestions, for game suggestions, link down below. For Twitch, it's on my About Me panel. You just go in there and type whatever you want to see me play. I, pl I do game suggestions every Tuesdays and Fridays. So, um, but that's it. I think I'm going to stop here. Thank you guys for joining. Thank you for talking with me. Especially Cutie Milan and Bevmoo for giving me those tips and tricks. That was really nice. Really, really helpful. <laughs> Kept me at least on a good focused pace. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you for chilling out with me. And I will see you maybe tomorrow? Maybe. I don't stream on Wednesdays, but maybe early tomorrow or Thursday. So, I'll just see you guys.